Hey guys, we're back with another episode of Bag Talk. And today's topic is deep shit. Literally, that's what the question <laughs> said. All right. We're just going to jump straight into this. The first question is... I don't ask questions. What? You the intro, you down there. Like, How are y'all doing today? Yeah, How was your right, day? Like How's you guys' day going? So I've been coming in the camera like this. Wait till I get my motherfucking hair done. The it's niggas gonna be on my body. Um, yeah, <laughs> first question is, what advice would you tell your ten year younger self? Ten year old younger self. Damn near everything I know right now. Ten years ago, I was ten years old. Thirteen. That's Thirteen. Crazy. I said that nigga. Don't. Don't trust none of these niggas be telling you. 12, 2011, I tell that nigga the world is not ended. You know <laughs> <laughs> no, for real. Hey. World is not about to end 2012. Niggas did not care about that. I, ain't gonna I, just say I didn't myself. care about they that. They were scared as hell. I'll just say be myself. Oh, yeah. Because I had a heart. You was trapped in the closet. I was trapped in the closet, bro. I'll just say be myself. Because, look, swear to God, everything I was scared of, it already it had, it happened. I would tell my younger self, the hard work is gonna pay off. No matter how slow the pace is, how fast it is, it's gonna pay off. Do the work, man. Just do it. That's why, like, just do the shit. Oh, Stop before we get all the extra. Work. No, sorry to cut you off. Before we get into our next question and everything, today is Gigi's birthday, y'all. Happy birthday! Oh, yeah. Yeah. Birthday, birthday season. I just gave you a fucking shout out. Everybody shout out. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Y'all want to send some cash? Be generous. Yeah, enough to drop, send we gonna drop the donation. cash app in yeah, the box. Yeah, or y'all, or money, y'all little lovely um, ladies. Yeah. On the, on the, and we gonna know. send. We gonna put the Zill one here because cash app been fucking up. Yeah, y'all, 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 y'all get niggas in Atlanta got off <laughs> <laughs> on that thirty k and shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah niggas shit in the negative. I would have did that shit was down here. I wouldn't have gave a fuck. I would have had a new yeah, whip, decent. new house, new everything. <laughs> Bitch, I would have been <laughs> off the grid. <laughs> Man, I would have did our big one there, bitch, because everybody's getting off on cash up. Nigga. Niggas don't even got cash up. Niggas bro, shit niggas, 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 niggas 100,000. I don't yeah. even want that much, bro. Yeah. Man. I just thought that shit was good. Niggas thought that shit was, they 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 was the sweet. But no, that shit wasn't even working for real, bro. Yeah, I tried it. Because niggas were trying to. You see, nigga, nigga, bro, decline. niggas see something with a dollar sign, exactly. bro. They do it. Hell yeah. That's what I'm saying. Y'all got to learn, bro. Everything is good as it seems, man. Y'all niggas do all that shit for that cash, bro, the whole time. They just be begging y'all niggas just to see what y'all gonna do. Hell yeah. You know everything about the shit every time, too. I mean, but shit, cash ain't a thing, bro. To these niggas, you can't tell them that, bro. Yeah, I mean, them niggas want to this, Mary To Jane. this generation, cash is everything. Ooh, I literally just seen a video on Instagram the other day. These two guys robbed this man. That nigga told him, give me everything. You got the other nigga got to tase him. Just tase the nigga. And he was reaching in his pockets to give him the shit. He tased his ass before he could even do it. He like, just don't shoot me. I'll give you everything. That nigga told him, take your take everything off, nigga. I don't give a fuck if you strip out your clothes. I'm like, damn. And nigga said, give me your pants. And that nigga got on a button up, man. Give me your pants. I'm like, this up. And that nigga said, give me your pants. Man, that nigga said, take everything. Sorry, nigga. What's your suit size? I was his ass. That nigga dropped on some cookies. I was sucking myself. Bitch, you can't say that. No, it's something. Hey, T. Yes, it is. Imagine if a police officer takes you. You know, they're like, no, they be holding a man. No, they be holding a button. 
Hey, they be going to put them in the car. if you ever got tased before, bro. That shit ain't <laughs> like that. They be gassing. Unless the voltage is high. Yeah, you got to get my tased. got higher voltage, little tased. If it's a little shit, bro, like a little zap, like a little, you feel me? You know, the motherfucking button cord to that string and shit. Yeah, I done seen niggas damage. That was cooking in That bitch stay in your motherfucking skin and shit. I done seen, I done seen cokeheads walk that bitch off. Man, it was a big, it was a big nigga walking to that bitch. He was walking on their ass. They put me in, they put another one in, that nigga went. Oh, bro, did I see that video? That nigga kept getting shot. He was, he was walking towards the uh, police officer. Yeah, they yeah. I'm blowing yeah. that nigga, bro. That yeah, nigga yeah, kept turning like that. Yeah. Yeah. He, he, he was walking to walk his phone. Yeah, they, they be doing them bitches. Yeah. That nigga like he was about to bite his ass. <laughs> yeah, because that motherfucking electricity is going through his yeah. ass. He can't do shit but tense. Yeah, that's crazy. I'm blowing a nigga like that. We didn't tase yeah, his ass strong. twice, nigga. What? You ain't going down? Bet you this bitch put you down to do that motherfucking Charles Gambino bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Not that this is America. Hey, I ain't gonna lie, Charles Gambino, you ain't with that. That, <laughs> that shit was a classic. <laughs> <laughs> hey, what you gonna get doing? <laughs> Bro, don't fucking way. No way. All right, next question is, if your future self went back in time, what would he or she tell you? You said what? If your future self went back in time, what would he slash she tell you? The damn bitch you out the closet? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, bitch, you been like that? Like, you, My like future self came dead. back yeah, to yeah, so like she, now. Yeah. yeah, What do you think he would tell you? Damn, Damn. Don't fuck up that 10K. <laughs> <laughs> Don't fuck up that 10K. Hopefully my future self come back you and tell me. You on the right path, my nigga. You on the right track. You feel me? Keep doing, doing that shit. That. Same. We did this, nigga. We got that we shit. We did that, yeah. Let me Every, show, let me show you my, you, let me show you our bank account real quick. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Everything yeah. that you've been dreaming, yeah. wishing upon, it all came true. That's all I hope. It just all comes true. Wallace being a real nigga, that's the crazy part. A lot of niggas can't do that shit. Still be, they still be who they is, man. Yeah. My, a lot of y'all niggas my, get my, on my, and then get off. Okay. It's my turn, bro. My shit coming. Shit, it's gonna pick up anyway. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Let me see. Um, let's jump into that next question. If someone gave you a hundred dollars, what would you spend it on? Hundred dollars ain't shit. Hundred dollars <laughs> is a new twenty dollars. Man, that's Man. Just a new twenty dollars. That's just a new twenty dollars for real. That should be like that. A hundred. Can't really do nothing with it. Can't get something to eat and fill your tank up at this point. Inflation ain't true. shit. That is true. You go to the next corner, nigga. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Can't even put that shit on no That's crazy as hell okay. to say now, bro. Because when you get, bro, if you gave me a hundred as a little nigga boy, man, you can do niggas cherish and that bitch with that nigga. Like, what you had? Gas station, nigga. Benji, man. I remember, oh, I remember for Christmas, I got my first blue strip. I was so geek. Yeah, oh my God, I was in there. just hit. Bro. Well, I got an Instagram account still out to this day named Baker o. Jordan. I know. I just Nigga, follow it. <laughs> you follow it? I need to see what's on that hoe. <laughs> bro. I just seen that shit the other day, bro. Hey. Nigga, hey. that was my inspirational name at the time. I want to be Jordan. Well, I didn't hear yeah, no, I, yeah. I ain't gonna do that thing. <laughs> I have a nickname. I want it to I'm be always, I want to be a YT too, I'm not gonna lie. Well, you know you're gonna be watching this shit. <laughs> <laughs> Want it? I think you still pursue that shit. No, I'm. I am a. Um, I'm a black yeah, queen. I am a black queen. God made me this way. Like and it change. Who the no, fuck don't no say that? that is. Is. No we love Selena Gomez. We're not a fan of Hailey Bieber. Fuck that bitch. She with my man already. Uh, Hailey Bieber. That's just the Selena. You saying this? I. I get he you used right. to love Selena. He used to. He still do. Straight, bro. Who? Still Justin man. Bieber. Yeah. That nigga. Cause I know this nigga face was drooping down and shit. I don't know what's up. what's wrong with what that. Bro? I don't know. And hit his ass with that. They yeah. probably did shit. Yeah, he him yeah. and his wife though. I think that shit was that shit was like kind of forced. Hit his ass with that. Yeah, you know them niggas in Hollywood weird as hell. Yeah. yeah. And Justin Bieber yeah, want to be the biggest black nigga. Yeah. He's, I think he still do. I ain't gonna lie. Still, it's like I think it's half and half. Like that first when he was always on that side, they was. 
Yeah, he'll get arrested. Yeah, that nigga, he said nigga in there and do everything. I'm like, yeah, he want to be black. Yeah, <laughs> He's so yeah. bad. Yeah, yeah. Look it up on YouTube. <laughs> <laughs> Look it up on YouTube. That bitch still yeah, there. Man, y'all can't be black, bro. If you white, just embrace that shit. Bro. Man, you, got powers you don't want to. Man, 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 that you, that you, you, you got white privilege. You got all type of shit. You don't want to be black. You don't want to be black. More than less, y'all probably come from Taylor Parks any fucking way. So shit. Yeah, if you Taylor white, then that shit different. Yeah. Yeah. But if you white, nigga, anywhere else, bro, embrace mm-hmm. that. Use that. If I was okay. white, nigga, I would not be in the motherfucking... Trish is with us. Man, you hear me? I'm not, I'm not trying to be thugging it with y'all, nigga. I'm, I'm black, and I don't even want to be black for right now. I'm black, and I'm proud. I love you, bro. I love yeah, oh, everybody want to be black. Like, well, everybody want to yeah. be us. Why everybody want to be us? But, but hated us. Hate us. That's so crazy. Hated us. Then still hate us. Man. Had us pink and cotton. Oh, I wish y'all would try that shit again. Boy, you try me. They, they, they know not to try that shit again. They know niggas. I don't even live in work, nah. Shit. Niggas, Boy, they know these niggas these days. It's not, it's not on that shit. Niggas is slaves. Bro, it's a, it was a video that kind of a little white boy. Yeah. I'm talking about whips and chains. Yeah. Nigga, try that shit again. It was, it was a little white boy went on the lady porch and he was hitting her porch with that whip. Y'all, Y'all ever seen, seen that? I whooped his ass. It was a little white boy. He <laughs> was that little bitch. He was hitting her shit. She got right on there like, get the fuck off my porch with that shit. I'm like, I would have snatched that shit. I would have snatched that shit. See that shit in his blood, though. You know how motherfucking boy, you got to get it. Bro, it's a video of a whole bunch of white people taking like a class. Bro, you gotta be K-K-K. nifty with that bitch, man. Bro, oh, the KKK, I'm real. Around. Yeah, they Fuck still y'all. around. Fuck y'all. Come over here with that shit, Fuck bitch. Y'all. You get blasted. Try me. No <laughs> I'm, I'm, I'm gonna hang bro. y'all niggas. Man, Feel get to line y'all shit up. Feel See me. how they did them niggas on motherfucking, um, what's that movie called? What's the movie called? Bad Sundown, Boys. Sundown Times. Bad that shit's still real. Tennessee? Mm-hmm. Yeah. 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 yeah, yeah. Got that nigga. Yeah. Don't ever try Nothing about racism. <laughs> we love everybody. We I love do. us. It's sure. reciprocation. Though. Mm-hmm. Sure that. I agree. I get what you give me. Agree. Next question is When is a good time to keep a secret? Oh, shit. Oh, Somebody tell me something in confidence, bro. I'm not going to just yeah. let this shit be. You know what I'm saying? Out to the public. Yeah. If they say, like, keep it between us, if, I'm if definitely going to say Only if the secret is harming you, that's when I would. Like, you know, I'm pretty little loud. It's no. like, only two keep a secret. Well, it's dead. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Like, that, shit, that shit affecting you. That's what keeps friend close. Spilling your secret. Trying to keep it from somebody <laughs> else and shit. Like, yeah. Like, like, like if a family member was to tell me they, they doing bad or something like that. I wouldn't just keep that secret until they motherfucker end up dying and shit. And then it's like a surprise to everybody else. But then I was already scared. Yeah, I, I hate, hate that shit like, too. I, that's how, that's how I feel about them Tyler Perry movies when there's always somebody that's sick and they want to wait to the very end yeah. when you're on your deathbed. Are you talking about something like that? Yeah. No, yeah. I ain't thinking about nothing. Or when you yeah. die and then all your shit come, come out. Come out. Hell wow, yeah. That's 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 that shit's so <laughs> bold. Yeah, that's, that's no, no cap. <laughs> that's like, I don't got no secret. Let me you took that shit to the grave. Yeah, like, what you doing? If it's some shit, I'll take it to the grave, nigga. Y'all better keep it there. I'm going to the rest hey, of y'all life. If y'all ain't hear it out of my mouth, shit. It ain't true. It ain't true. It ain't true. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah. Yeah. that shit early. We went to bed. Can't got no receipts. <laughs> no, 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 I really do. I mean, you know, know, yeah, it all depends. Like, you know what you tell me. Depending, yeah. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Nick, if it's that top tell secret, me, bro, you'll be surprised, bro. Niggas tell me everything, like, bro. I don't, I don't know what it is. Niggas just always tell me shit. Sometimes, if bro, it's I a just, secret and I'm too excited, I will spill it because I'm just so geeked. Like, I try to cover it, but then I'll be like, oh fuck, I just said the shit. I ain't spilling no sauce, man. But if it's It'll something, if it's something that deep, I keep it in between. Like, I won't tell nobody. Like, I tell them. Like, but that's why I say like pinky promise all the time. Mm-hmm. You break my promise, you break my trust. I still do. <laughs> <laughs> I still believe in pinky promises. Yeah. Them shits is cap, bro. I just mm-hmm. did a pinky promise the other day. Damn, you you up. Up. You no, I didn't him. do it. It was the other person. You are you know fucked who you up, is too. Being. I ain't break the pinky promise though. Really? Oh, did you? No. No. Um, what is your definition of cheating? Entertaining anything outside of what we have going on with any, oh, any gender. Texting back, um, 
Bro, so y'all, hold on, y'all just be wanting y'all significant other like dead to the world. No, no, no. When I say texting back, I mean texting a few. Like if it's flirtatious and you're responding to that, you're entertaining that. That's mm-hmm. what I mean when I say texting. Like if you got a, if you got a home girl that y'all have been cool since y'all was like kids or something. I, no, I'm not about to be like, oh, cut her off. Like I'm not gonna do that to you. That's 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 insecure. You got something in with yourself mm-hmm. that you that you just don't like, and I'm not that kind of person. That's your hunger. That's your hunger. Because if I got guy friends, you can't be mad at me for that. Mm-hmm. But if y'all texting on some. Damn, you looking good today, type shit, bitch. Please, okay. you and that nigga gonna get it. But it's it's a difference. Been doing it's a, no, it's a difference. <laughs> she it's she a difference. It's a difference. But uh, uh, how you doing it? If you just keep going with it with the emojis and all, no, nigga, do you do that to me? No, I'm you not doing keep that. it simple. Like anything you want to do in front of me, type shit. Right. Anything Agreed. you want to do in front of me. Yeah. Or if you feel guilty doing that shit, yeah, that be done. yeah, yeah. That's like when people say, like, I didn't. You indecisive I still about that shit. You didn't love me when you was yeah. you coochie. You gotta be yeah. furtive with that. Don't do that, bro. I'm yeah. Don't do that. B, you don't got no definition of cheating, or you just agree with what we said? Yeah, I was just throwing that in the bus. Okay. Tell us about a great date you guys had. <laughs> I don't think Is I had date. Well, date. I took somebody off for their birthday. That's probably like the closest it had been to. Cause every time, every time I go on a date, it's mm. always like spontaneous. Mm. So yeah, it's like really. Like, but don't be the best. Yeah. Depends like on who you with. Okay. Okay. okay sure. Like sometimes it'd be like, nigga, I'm ready to go at like seven o'clock. Whole time they pushing it back to like ten o'clock, and I'm like, bro. Yeah, I don't like it. I don't like people. Yeah, that push that push it back like that. The best day I've ever had. Oh, I'm so sorry. I hate when girls be doing that shit. <laughs> you gonna hate me like. Just say next time, bro. Cause okay. I ain't trying to do all that other shit. No, man. if it's something I'm if trying to, if, if I'm go, trying to if get, come to that, I know if I'm trying to get out of it, <laughs> if I'm trying to get out of it, if it's, if it's something uh, like bro. that, I'm trying to get out of it. I would at least be like, let's let's do something different. We can still hang out that day, but just not this. If it's not, if I can't get you that that time, mm-hmm. then I'm gonna say like, okay, can we do this instead? Because I won't be on this time, but I would still like to go out with you, you know. To try to at least, you know, like boost your ego still a little bit and not hurt you a lot. No, no, don't, don't cap to me, man. Let me no, know how it is. Exactly. No, if, if, I, if, I, can't, if I can't make it that time, I'll no, be, like, be, be Bro, y'all be this. killing me with that. Like, nigga, if you don't want to kick it with me, don't try to pull that, no bullshit, yeah. bro, because I already sensed that. Mm-hmm. So if you're just trying to get a free meal or something, that's not going. That's not going. Yeah, you need to run on that. That's what I'm saying, bro. And then some type of shit, bro. I just be feeling played with, and I'm not going to lie that shit. Y'all, they do not tell us a great date. Let me tell y'all my great date. I know. What you want niggas to go into detail or something? I went, my, um, like, real first date as, like, an adult, he took me to Black Rock. Mm -hmm. And it was so sweet, because I had never been, like, taken out by, like, a guy or whatever. So I was like, he's really nice. He's really sweet. You know, got me flowers and everything. It was real nice. Real elegant, real, real cute. Y'all can, y'all can tell stories cute. like that too, though, because y'all females. Females do not take niggas on dates. Oh, yeah. Females yeah. don't be like, oh, I'm going to take you out. Let me do I, this, this it, and that. It dep- I, will, I won't say like I got. I will set up everything, but I definitely will make plans. And I don't mind paying. I don't have. I don't need no nigga. I don't want to be with no nigga that's, you got to pay every time. Like, let, let, I don't mind. If I got the money to do it, I'm going to do it. It's just a, it's a thing, like a reciprocation type thing. I feel like it should go both ways. And I feel like that even on the first day, shit. How you, how you do it though? What what man are you doing it? Like what they set mean? the bill on the table, you let it sit there, and then no. you do it, or you no, do it, like, let me it, get that. if I pick it up, or I tell them to begin with, like I'll pay, I'm not paying, or if we going 50 50 I I'll pay for this, you pay for that. Like if yeah. it's like a movie thing, I pay for the that? tickets. Or you, you I tell them, I tell them off the off rip. Like if it's our first day and you asking me, I'm assuming you're gonna pay. But yeah, if I'm making sure. if I'm making plans and stuff, yeah, okay, I'm going I'm gonna contribute to something. I'm just gonna sit back and be like, oh yeah, I did make the plans, but nigga, you paying? I'm not like that. That's yeah. crazy. I'm that not, I'm not gonna go. Crazy. That's like that's like we that's like making man, plans that's and not have no money. Yeah, no, that's how that's this how, fuck, this how crazy they be playing it. Uh-uh. You gotta come scoop them. You gotta make the date. Yeah, and you I, gotta you pay already, for the day, yeah. and you gotta take them back home, you and then you still thing. gotta man. Yeah. You still that's gotta what I mean, because to me, pussy or not. you because mm-hmm. you come that's to pick crazy. me up anyway, because I don't drive, so that's the least I can do. Should that's I need something in return? No, nah. but everybody not. Like everybody is not like yeah, that. Yeah, no, I'm, I'm a sweet person. You. And y'all know who y'all is, bro. I'm trying to tell you. <laughs> <laughs> just last night, I'm pulling up on all four of y'all hoes, like, bro. 
You remember that? I'm I know dead. you do. Nah, that I know you do. Crazy. What? That shit My... head dead for him. Nah. I'm nah, so nah. Stabbing outside of your Put house. Little date. Bro, I'm like, I don't, I don't like, well, I do like the little That's intimate stuff, but like, I'm more like a fun person, bro. If I can have fun with you, then I'm enjoying myself. You don't like bro. intimacy type of date stuff? I, I, really say, I say know. I do, I ain't gonna lie. but I like fun dates more. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's. I feel like, yeah, I I feel like at one point you have to establish the intimacy because then if it's not, I don't, to me I feel like because the older I get, like I'm not ready to like settle down, get married, have kids, mm-hmm. but I definitely want something intimacy because then I really, at that point I feel like we okay, we taking each other serious, okay. like we establishing something serious, we progressing in a serious more way. I we can still do something fun, don't get me wrong, but you know when it comes to the intimacy thing, then it's like okay, this is cool, we actually get to vibe, you know. Yeah, I feel, I feel like the intimacy part. Comes like when y'all in the car and all that, all the, yeah, all the little just driving around, around you feel me? You feel me? You can do that after like, and you know, like dude, I be hating when y'all be trying to kill that shit. Like I'm just trying to make a little joke or something. You just like, <laughs> no, I could never be like that. Come if it's, too, yeah, it depends yeah. on or, or just doing some shit that kill the whole moment. Yeah, I'd if be it's like, something, right, if they, that's how you can tell how comfortable it is. But then sometimes I don't. I'm never like if I'm just me and you. I can't like I am a shy person, but I'm never gonna be like stop joking because I once I get comfortable, nigga, I ain't gonna wanna stop joking. Yeah. <laughs> so, and I'm told that's, that's like that's, the little, that's why it's the little icebreaker for me because I, yeah. I, yeah. I like to knock the little dust off so your shoulders and shit, you get you yeah, get you out of your fit. Sure, sure, sure. I agree. Well, every person I didn't talk to, I didn't work with, so we are. <laughs> God, that's a red flag. A red flag. Bro, you can't be doing it. I swear to God, God, every job I done work for, I do something to my co worker. Literally. Damn, I'm not going to cap. That'd be the best. Far, far from the <laughs> <laughs> I'm hey, telling you, y'all, that'd be the best sometimes. Like that, you get with that co worker. I can't have no relationship with that. I can't do it, bro. I didn't know that. Yeah, but we can be on, we going to be on him. You know, you know what I'm saying? But I can't have no relationship. And one thing about it, every guy, every time they ended up quit, like Gary fired or quit or something. So it was like we were still, <laughs> oh, we were still fucking yeah, around yeah. too. So okay, yeah, you know, that's different. That's different. Yeah, but every job I didn't, I didn't always pull me a nigga. Come on, now. I got bro, the you sauce supposed like to that. be a younger brother, bro. I, <laughs> <be a> <laughs> <brother. laughs> I got the sauce like that, y'all. But no, that's real. Yeah, I do be doing that. that job. I ain't got the best game. I mean, if I would be there. Motherfucker like all the time, bro, and I'm a hate coming to this bitch. I'ma have to make some type of fun out of this. Hell yeah. I gotta do something. That's that's how we been at McDonald's. We was both new. And that shit just we got locked in so quick it was just like easy. Like y'all the only nigga that wasn't weird in that bitch though. Yeah, I was the I was the only one not like crushing on her and shit. So like literally Mm -hmm. everybody in that bitch was bro. I'm like, yeah, no, it's not for me. (laughs) I'm dead. Um let me see where we at, where we at, where we at. What is one thing you need to work on for yourself? Mm-hmm. I'd say my emotions. I don't know how to handle my emotions work for me. I just yeah. shut down. Communicate. I would say um, procrastination and learning how to say no and letting go when to let go. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I would say being easier on myself. I'm so hard on myself, so it don't even make no sense. It's all for a reason, but at the same time, like, I don't even enjoy shit the same no more. Mm-hmm. Like today, prime example, y'all niggas telling me how to do yeah. that's, that's a different reason, though. I'm mm-hmm. not going to lie. That's for a different reason, but at the same time, it's like, like I don't pat myself on the back unless it's deserving. Like, everything is yeah. based upon the reward. Yeah, I remember, I remember one time we was trying to go somewhere, and you told me, like, no, I didn't achieve something, so I don't deserve to go. Yeah, and man. I was like, man, don't you ever. Gotta, you got to you know, figure out how to. You do. You gotta, I agree with that, but you gotta I just earn like, your, your dopamine, man. So, look, if you go into the bar every motherfucking weekend, that's going to burn out. So, when you actually accomplish something, you go out to the bar, it's going to be the same shit. Yeah. Ain't gonna be no dopamine rush. Yeah, so at that that's point, you burning all your wishes. I don't yeah, really care to go to the club for my birthday. Now, for me, I feel like my birthday is just like being able to spend time with y'all as much as possible. Like, like at any any given day. I don't give a fuck if it's just a regular day. Like as long as I'm just intertwined with y'all, that's but, all that matters. Yeah, that's what I'm going off of that. I feel like every day should feel like your birthday, bro. Yeah. Yeah, Every day should be something the, crazy. That's why the like your birthday should be just shit. like this high yeah. ass pedestal mm-hmm. day. Yeah, yeah. wait for yeah. Yeah. Like yeah, you planning for a nigga. Every day should be like that. That's why the Muslims yeah. don't celebrate yeah. holidays or nothing like that. They say yeah. you should cherish every day, nigga. You shouldn't mm-hmm. just wait until the 364th day to, to live like that. You feel me? So, right. you ain't wake yourself up. 
Man. Gateway person. Man. True. And tomorrow is not promised, bro. Nah. Agreed. Yeah, so. I try to live every day like my last day, but. Life. That shit hard, man. Yeah, life that shit life, is man. so hard. Well, I be having you know, to click back in, like, hey. actually, I don't live every day like it's my last day. You know, I, I just be get, I, I just know. get up Bobby and be tried. like, shit. It's another one. You feel me? Another day to be Let's great. get up, brush our teeth, listen to some upbeat music, and I just be trying to tell myself every day, like, have a good day. Don't let nothing get you down. Yeah, no matter if it's something crazy. that gets yeah, you that upset, end, and then I just be day, like, bro. keep going. Till you reach that shit, and I reach that shit, you gonna see me grinning ear to ear. And that's how I felt yesterday. Like I was in such a good mood. As soon as I got to school, it was like no. That shit turned right back. I swear to you, that's why I end up crying at school. I'm like, something is like not you, right. You make your environment up, bro. So like you go in the school with a brighter attitude, it'll brighten up the whole, you feel me? Like, yeah, that's how I felt going in. But it's like once I got there and she just the professor was just talking, I'm like, what the fuck? Why am I here? Oh, yeah, you gonna have and I normally, sure. normally like school, I'd be so geek. Like I've been saying it for the whole time. Like, I'm so ready to go to school. I'm so ready to go to school. I'm so excited about class. Yesterday was just like, man. It's gonna be them days for sure. I remember yeah. I was in school, bro. That shit was so apprehensive. I'm like, oh my god. I just want this shit to be over. I'm popular. That's opinion. how I'm feeling right now. I love school, bro. I do. I, I love know, school. Like, do not get no. me wrong. But this is just Only this thing class. Was school work. Well, it was making me regret it. Nigga. I mess with everybody, so they're just gonna give me the answer anyway. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's like, like that with college. No, oh, school if school was built the around the criteria that you were supposed to, to learn to that. That should so be nice. Man, I ain't gonna lie, yeah, yeah, that, that community. Nice. So our class I'm saying is big. You know how on like um like shows they be having the auditoriums and they seats sit up from the professor? Nigga, we yeah, like in a regular classroom. classroom. Yeah. We just right there. Yeah, that's the only thing that I that I would say like that I don't like about the community college. Like it's big, don't get me wrong. But it's none of the rooms are set up like that. Like it gives you that college experience, but it's nothing like a university. Nothing that you experience. That I hear from so many people like you gotta go to university like just to get the experience. I and know. I agree. I feel like I feel like when COVID came around, that shit changed. Yeah, that shit kind of like everything. Yeah, that shit I agree. changed I agree. school I agree. like mud. Cause nigga, before that, college was so crazy, bro. I can only imagine, man. College was so crazy, and then coming back the year after. And then just like nigga, it was like a tumbleweed could have rolled through the campus, bro. That shit was so depressing and like hell no, bro. This shit we just not that on purpose. They cooked niggas whole twenty twenty, bro. I swear to God. Man, man. Shit would have been way different. And I graduated that year too. That shit was so boo. I was away from them. I was in Missouri when COVID hit. I know you was good. That shit was so boring. We lived in a fucking three bedroom apartment. That was a two. It was really a two. We just turned the other room into a, another room. Mm-hmm. But that shit was just, was nothing. I was looking at the same face all day. We used to go to Walmart every day. Literally, that's the most fun we got out of our COVID experience. Mm-hmm. Until my auntie and them came down there. We played games and got drunk. And then I t- that's when I told myself, I'm like, I'm coming back home. Fuck she, that this, shit, bro. That's, this Fuck is what we should have been doing during the motherfucking lockdown, bro. Because yeah. we would have been paid right now. I ain't going to lie. We used to get cooked every, every day. day, bro. Literally. Nigga, it's a different nigga throwing up every night, bro. <laughs> <laughs> that shit was that funny shit. as hell. Man, crazy, niggas then used to go to bed till like five, six in the morning. <laughs> That's the crazy thing. Shit. Eating dinner as a family, bottles right there, straight man, to it. <laughs> Literally, I swear to God, we used to eat dinner. Niggas weed. get straight to drinking. Oh, weed, man. Weed, my oh my God, I used to smoke so much. much. That shit used to, you wouldn't Girl. even believe it. 420 was crazy. Animal. Niggas was knocked out midday trying to get high. See, I was so blown. Man, cooked as hell. Cooked as fuck. <laughs> that shit is crazy. Yeah, it's crazy. No. And I used to be doing schoolwork. Oh, you see on my computer trying to do fucking French class and shit. Uh, COVID was, was a time. That was what? a good. That was a good no, time. That lockdown here. Yeah, you should have asked because you was in the apartment too. I ain't here. I ain't here. I ain't care about no class. Once we came up, they came up. A baby, a baby, and a That's literally all it was for me. I'm like, what the fuck? Bro, shut down. Ooh, shut Spend down. Spend money on my PlayStation. Yeah, he he did have a PlayStation. That's what I was doing. All we day. used to just play Mortal Kombat. That's all I used to do. And then he went to work. Niggas. Random friends. And that's during COVID. That's when I started to like. At that time, even though we was when we was in school still, and night I used to sneak out like a motherfucker because we had everybody that lived in that complex complex had parents that worked the same shit. Mm-hmm. So when they parents was gone, it was like shit free for all. Mm-hmm. Make sure his ass was tucked in bed. I used to be like, shit, get the fuck on, couldn't do it. That's when I started smoking. You said that was your first time doing LSD too, right? 
that shit I ain't gonna lie to you. Serious, that yeah. was fun. I, I do be messing up sometimes. So it's like, damn, I tried out for wrestling. Ugh, never again. <laughs> never again, I swear to that wrestling. I know they was getting on your Boy, after that, this. Man, I'm yeah. like, hell no, this is not for me. And Fuck on. Oh, body. Damn, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I fuck you I'm like, nah, this ain't, this, I can't do this. You gotta be an animal to do that shit, bro. Yeah, All that shit, UFC, that boxing, all that shit, bro, you gotta have a motherfucking body. Yeah, I'm like, damn, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, I'm like, damn, 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 I'm I would never do. I would never switching, do that again. You gotta have a switch in your brain mentally, like nigga. I'm Dumb niggas did used to be fucking each shit. other up though, but that shit, it was fun to like practice. But once they start to get the flipping, I'm like, oh fuck, I'll sit out. I was sitting out. The workout was fun, the, the all that. But once it t- once it came to getting on the motherfucking mats, <laughs> fuck no, I used to be like hell. <laughs> yeah, man, I used to be a tomboy. That's not, it's so crazy how yeah, literally. Shit funny as hell. I didn't she put in the backyard message. with us playing pick em up, mess em up. That shit funny as hell. I used to have a time in my life. Mama did not like that shit That's at all. Shit, boy. Mama did not like that at all. But that was pretty, I swear, that was like my funnest favorite yeah, one. You can't, you can't switch over. No, I cannot. <laughs> no. <laughs> Y'all gotta have the girl somewhere. So why? So I gotta be a stud? You be a stud. I used to. You be a stud. Be a stud, bro. You ain't got to OD it. What y'all want me to wear? Hoop shorts and slides. No, and shit? nigga, that's what I'm saying. You ain't got to OD it, but. You feel me? I'm not getting no dress and I like that. Get in that twat. Uh, absolutely <laughs> not. <laughs> I will fucking pass. Uh-huh. I don't know. You don't know what you missed. I, I don't got nothing against the community. I love y'all, but it's just not for me. Not for you know? Me. Community. I love for the community. Y'all lucky, boy. I swear I've seen some shit like that. The Afro-Bat community. Community. <laughs> community. Y'all niggas get y'all own, huh? Is it, or is it, is it a month or is it a week? It's a, it's a month. Y'all get y'all own, huh, bro? You know? yeah. That shit was ass this year. I don't they know They celebrate Pride yeah. Month more than Black History. You hear me? That's why I ain't even trying to get That's on true. that, bro. That's true. They, no, they, they got, they got emojis. Yeah. <laughs> y'all motherfuckers do not play. Y'all want to pull up to this, though? Y'all going to get y'all ass blew down, nigga. That's unfortunate. I want my nigga Dave Chappelle. You feel me? <laughs> Fuck y'all niggas, They gonna be mad at you because you're not supporting them. <laughs> yeah. Look at me. Yeah, why you ain't standing up for us? You just been about to get hanged <laughs> fuck with these niggas. Man. Grandma yeah, said, that's where you gonna die. I'm getting too mandatory. They killing. Oh my God. I don't know how they gonna get you niggas get too much privilege, bro. They definitely, they definitely have a new time, bro. It's just too much. It's too much. It's too, the sports and the bathroom and shit is the only thing I don't like. I don't know. Everything so else, I'm cool. Okay. You, you can die your little y'all preference of what you itch. like. Y'all take them out, bro. It's changing the whole It's just, it's just like sports. I don't really fuck with what I understand. I'll leave that to them. I'm one thing, that's about it. You feel me? <laughs> so simplistic. Yeah, Everybody I'm, else want to yeah, be they, them. Like, yeah, what the I'm, fuck, bro? You're an individual yeah. person. What the fuck you talking about they? I don't understand I that. Honestly, I don't. I, I, I would hate. I, that's why I hate for people when they do that shit. Don't talk to me. Just leave me hey, alone. You feel me? Because I don't even know what to address you, you as. Me? And the moment you get defensive with me, nigga, what the fuck? And I ain't about to dish you. Bitch, how the fuck? Do. Yeah, how the fuck am I supposed to know? You look like this and you go, I, I, yeah, bitch, I don't understand supposed to know. The moment, the it, moment you see a, a whole nigga walking into a female bathroom is wicked. It's crazy because it's wicked, like bro. you take your kids in there. It's that little girls that's in there. Yeah. And, and, and now you imagine, see a imagine, guy. Imagine if he an imposer, though. He just acting like that. You the whole time he in the bathroom trying to get something. That shit weird, bro. You open the door for niggas like just like that's, that's weird. exactly what that's it could, weird as fuck. Yeah, that's 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 scary. I, Y'all I, I taking this agree. shit uh, that's a little bit too, too beyond the motherfucking that. perimeter. The sports in the bathrooms is the only thing I have. It's no way it should be a guy running track with a female. There, because your chemistry and shit, not even everything. Same. Every the, a guy is automatically gonna win. Like what? That's Y'all crazy. That even even football, they come on now. It's a guy. They were born a guy. They don't. They not well, a. They not a woman just because you got the name of one and you got the parts we have. That did not make you a girl. And I hate guys like I, that's why. I, no offense to the gay boys, but that's why I do not fuck with y'all. Cause y'all want to be so much of a bitch and y'all not, bro. Y'all are. Y'all is not no girls. No offense to y'all, but y'all is not a bitch. Oh, Leave that to us. You can't get no babies. You can't have no periods. Shut the fuck up and keep tucking that dick. 
That's all I'm gonna say. Yeah, vice versa. I ain't gonna care. True. Yeah. True. Yeah. I agree. The girls, stay, cause you just was cause not you on the put them up. Just cause you step your feet in them bitches. <laughs> that don't make you that. It's a whole different ball game. It doesn't. Next question, guys. Cause we're gonna start talking about <laughs> the community. <laughs> we just said oh, no racism. Hey, hey man, it's yeah, open, yeah, bro. Yeah, niggas, yeah, can, yeah, right, niggas cannot handle no what hatred. I want to say. Oh, no, no, I don't hate social. nobody. Yeah. I didn't don't like that. Just no, like, bitch, I'm not fucking yeah. ugly. Yeah. 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 It's like, no. That's yeah, no I'm slander. Not, we just speaking the truth. That be why y'all be getting so defensive. Whenever niggas tell the truth, yeah, I'm just me. That's when niggas get defensive. Yeah, I like what I like, and that's about it. Right. I'm not into relationships. Good, great, 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 great. The next question is, when was the last time you felt loved? No. Right. Yeah, stay surrounded by it. I'm in love, y'all. In love? Feel, I think that's two different feel, things, though. You don't feel though. loved by everybody else, though? Yeah. But not in love. We're not talking about in love. Yeah. Unless you feel mm, love. No, not really. You don't feel love? By I don't like, you love? No, I can I say? Well, I say by y'all, but like, in my inner, inner stuff, I feel like Inner circle, I feel like I'm like a circumstantial type of thing. Mm. Yeah. Other than that, I, hate, I, like I, I, I have a love hate with your family. Yeah. And I love it's them, just, but it's it gets under like my skin so bad. Because I think outside of like this threshold, it don't come from nowhere else. Probably Absolutely like one not. or two other people that I can say like if I was to go out on a limb, I have my back turned mm-hmm. type shit. They, you feel me? They right yeah. with me. Yeah. But I can't other than that. Same. Yeah. That's the one I came with. Like, when y'all embraced me, y'all was like, what? Yeah, as long yeah. as you cool, like, bro. Yeah, she was yeah. shot a nigga, bro. When I came to the I'm like, what? That's how I get for real, for real. Yeah. Yeah, no, no real, I agree with you, G. I don't got, besides, like, you and, like, Mama and Cameron, other than that, and my family, other than that, barely So she just lets y'all know we some solidified gangsters for real, bro. You feel me? Don't ever question none of this shit we got going on over here. You'll always be welcome here. Ain't no hate in my heart for nobody. Feel no, that's, no. that's the first me. time I came in. It's like some real, like, y'all don't want nothing. Y'all just like my vibes. Yeah, yeah man. Chillin niggas be chilling yeah. until provoke, bro. Like, when you yeah, provoke yeah, niggas. I ain't never going to do that because I'm just... Yeah, chill. Chilling. Yeah. Like but chilling. then all that is a conversation can kill so much, mm-hmm. so much attention. Yeah. Y'all so yeah. real. I came yeah. in like, like, damn, wait. <laughs> That's what we were, bro. Yeah, I'm like, I can talk like this. Women. Okay. Yeah, I can so be like this. Why you think I'm so blunt? Yeah, it's like, I like, cannot yeah. hide that shit. Like, yeah, but yeah, that's literally, yeah, I'm true. true with it. Yeah. <laughs> true. No, <laughs> <laughs> like, true. no, no, no. Yeah. No, but I can't say. It was still some people trying to like sit there asking me like Amari asked me like, so what do she go by? And I'm like, what you mean? He like he she they them. I'm like this is just Daylon, bro. Yeah, just call it Daylon. Well, and then still, somebody still asked me made like, off respectful. I think one of y'all, yeah, yeah. He was still doing, I think one of y'all asked me like, so is it okay if I call her bro? I'm like she don't give a fuck. I mean I think I just let it slip out like the first time I said it. Like, <laughs> yeah. She that's yeah, one yeah, thing. That, you, I, bro, that's like, one thing Daylon she do yeah. not care about none of that yeah. stuff. Like I'm not even when even when we be in the club and stuff like it, I think it bothered me more than it bothered her. Yeah. Like, cause I was like, that's so it's probably cause you used to that shit, bro. I ain't yeah. gonna lie, when you when you immune to certain shit, bro, you damn near don't even hear it no yeah, more. Yeah, don't even affect you like you do. We be bro. joking. I'll be ready to go to a person like, yeah, this is a girl. Or <laughs> <laughs> just a joke. It just, I know that the whole time. They really don't. Yeah, they really never. I really don't know. Wait, wait, wait. I'm like, bro, just trying to figure that out. I don't know, but bro, I'm yeah, that shit. I'm like, this would be the funniest shit in the world, but yeah, I don't know. Confused and niggas mm-hmm. be down there Definitely. stuttering like that. I don't know. <laughs> Definitely. I think that's so funny. Yeah. Um, I got a couple people. Like outside of my family, I consider like family. Mm-hmm. You know? I feel like, yeah. Some, some that's closer than actual family. You feel me? True. Time. True, you know? that. Y'all know who y'all live too, bro. I would name drop, but. Yeah. You just know. You, you know, yeah, you know. Yeah, like definitely. Yeah, yeah, definitely. Definitely. Um, what is one thing or activity that makes you feel alive? Alive. Yeah. Most definitely anything that gets your adrenaline rushing, except for roller coasters. I'm not fucking with roller coasters. <laughs> man, man, but like shit. zip lining, <laughs> rafting. You remember that zip lining? Yeah, nigga. Oh uh, yeah, okay. Uh. Shit, I'm fucking zip lining. Doing hundred, hundred in the car. That's the whole point. That's the reason why they make this shit. Like, 
like yeah. fully being in the you, moment. You know what makes me be alive? When I go out and have a great fucking time. Yeah. Like That's it's very no rare, it's yeah, that it is, but it's like it's like, no ooh, hiccups. Last year for my birthday we went to spot. That, that shit, shit oh that shit was crazy. My that fucking whole fucking God. night was at work. Damn, what? Bruh, and we got put over that night <laughs> in the Tesla. Oh yes, oh, that oh, shit oh, was a night yeah. like that for no, sure. The other night when we went to Del Mar, a hundred and ten percent I just when yeah. I asked y'all to go out with us. I yeah. wish I would have came. That shit was so fun. They was yeah, letting us in. They was letting us crazy, in bro. and out the club yeah, and everything. Yo, and, and not paying like that. Man, yeah, yes, that, that shit was so fun. Yeah. It, and that bitch was jumping. Yeah. It was so many birthdays. Yeah, it was a group of people bro. that we didn't even know. They thought we came with mm-hmm. them. That's how lit we was. Mm-hmm. And that bitch just. They were like, y'all come up. back with us? I'm like, we don't know y'all. Man. Man, that's the sad, bro. That's what I be saying. Man, that shit, in Michigan, you cannot that, find shit like that. Yeah, that bro. shit was so fun. I'm like, I'm just hanging as soon as you hit the dump. Man, Man. Man. that right honestly was like the best. I'm saying, that's why Spotlight. That bro, shit. if y'all ever want to get a motherfucking, bro, get a Yerky and go to Spotlight. Uh, man, get, <laughs> go get a fucking drink. They gonna have your Yerky. ass and that bitch jumping. <laughs> That second time we phone went, phone. oh my motherfucking that god! Time. That time, that bitch damn like I'm gonna have to bail tomorrow. <laughs> so, y'all when I went there and I was dancing in that bitch, I'm like, boy, they they, they got my ass like drunk off the motherfucking Long Island. Nigga, if you ain't never seen a party like in the movies type party, that's that yeah. bitch. That's, that's that. Yeah. Sure. That's why I wanted to go to a college party too, cause I've never been. To yeah. an actual college party. That's, that's that one thing one. I want to like, do too. You, you talk, all good you vibes. You ain't got to look over you your shoulder. Nothing, 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 nigga. You chilling. You can all dance time. with anybody and still be like shit. Yeah. You ain't got to worry about nothing. I say it's so much going on that you don't, like, nigga, you just in that bitch party. All the time. The world can be in and outside. Nigga, you out there. That bitch look turned lit. <laughs> man, we went yeah. when Anissa came. We was eating a motherfucking truffle fries. Them bitches was made so wrong, but they were so good because we were so drunk. Yeah, that's that place is definitely a vibe. Y'all should go check that out. Shit like that for sure. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. We could have had a night like that in Houston. Yeah, for just, hell uh, yeah. I feel like, like going out in nature, bro. Like where it ain't a whole lot of people, and then you just can take that like deep ass breath. It's like it's fresh. <sighs> you feel me? No you know, fucking contamination. Yeah. No polluted air. And that joint is so different, bro. Like when we went to ATL, bro, you could feel the difference in the air, bro. As soon as we yeah, came back here, it's like, bro, it's like shorten breast and junk like that. Because you know, all there, it's like woodlands down there everywhere you go type shit. Uh, it's just so different, bro. That's why that city living. That ain't for everybody, bro. Uh, that's just like a junkie I'm type I'm a type city. I, I like the city. I don't like, yeah, uh, I like the You put me like 30, 30, 25, 30 minutes out from the city, I'm smooth, bro. Other than that, I'm smooth. I'm man, man, I think I'm meant for the city. I love the. I would love to do the country activities like the. When I say country, I mean like the line dancing and the boots and the hats and all that kind of stuff. Bell bottoms, all that kind of shit. Or if y'all got some weddings, bro. If y'all getting married soon. Oh my god, yes. Because I heard they be getting teed up at weddings. Yeah, I want to crash a wedding. I heard niggas be teeing up at weddings. That's some bucket list type shit, bro. Crash a wedding. I don't even know who shit this is. They like, yeah, you here with Johnny? Yeah, nigga. Congratulations, yeah. Yeah, I agree. I definitely got to get into some more weddings. doing shit that you ain't this never thought of. This lady told me she, she met her husband there, and they've been married for 41 years. So, Damn. Yeah. So, yeah. Like that. That's why you're not supposed to leave out the house just looking like anything, bro. You never know. Who See, you know. I tell mama that all the time, and mama say, they should love you looking at your own. Oh, lovers. first impression is no, everything. First, you might meet yes, your yes, first impression is everything. You feel me? Your lifelong wife. Yes, so that's why I always yeah, leave out the house and shit like anything. Man. At least try to quarter coordinate, hey, you especially if you're going to Target. Oh, <laughs> you know, for real, I have a little TV in Target. Where I be? I be at Target. Target. Ain't even got no agenda, nigga. Yeah, I'm just letting it strong. Like. That's how niggas spend money in that bitch. I don't give a fuck. I'm going to a gas station. I'm walking that bitch. I don't give a fuck if I'm going to a gas station. Little Milfies, Milfies, if y'all feeling me, I'm feeling y'all most definitely. Yeah, we. I put y'all over everything. Fuck them young tenderonies. I need me a little cool oh, mama. I love milk. I need one of them shirts, bro. You feel I me? Think and you know, I need you know, you know something. I think that's really true. Because look at Anissa. Look at you. Me, I like older guys. I've never seen you with somebody like super older. But I really think mama got that in her. Because God fucking damn. She she married Shit. a nigga that was 21 years older. I like them young niggas. 
Yeah, we know. She, <laughs> she, she, like, she like them the young, young pieces. Yeah, it just be like they be a little bit irritating sometimes. Like bro, the younger like, ones, them like, old motherfuckers that go put up with your know. shit. They not, they you got they one they time you're out of there. They know exactly what they want. They not gonna play no type of games. 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 This what it is. This what it is. Like an yeah, uh, older female, like, oh, she gonna tell yo ass. Most yeah, she ain't not exactly how she gonna do it. That bitch not gonna play no type of games. Like nigga, we all that. You feel me? I'm about to do it. Yeah, okay, nigga. Is you is you up for this or not, nigga? Yeah, yeah, every time. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, that's all you had to say. Yeah, I like being a man, but some some grown men can be boys too. Yeah, don't think don't let that age fool you. True, true, true. Age ain't nothing but a number. Aaliyah and R. Kelly said that. Hey. <laughs> <laughs> that shit, Ricky, bro. Hey, that nigga was piping hoes. Hey, y'all! I don't know if I could be a 40-year-old nigga trying to mess with a 20-year-old, bro. That's all right. That shit is so weird, bro. I'm 24. I don't even think I can shoot lower than 21. I figured that. Yeah, 21 is, is, is hell. No. Man, if he 20, messes somebody my age, hell no. I'm gonna be looking at them bitches. 20, like, I damn look like, like, like a child. Like you gotta be mature in the head. Okay, you gotta wait, talk to me, and I can't know you 20 years so old. So do y'all think I'm mature you. for my age? Most yeah, I think everybody mature. Yeah, cause I definitely well, pull a lot of grown, grown men. I definitely do. I ain't never talked to nobody under 20. I don't think nobody is here. Like 19, literally. Honestly, say that. Yeah, 19 is about to. Yeah, you, 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 you don't you, even need to be pushing 19. You, you cutting it, man. You cutting it. Well, I'm 21, so I'm pushing 19. 22, damn. I'm, 19. I'm just telling niggas that's three years. 22, bro. yeah. 18. I, like 18. 18. I don't like guys I my age or lower. You could be 20, which is cool, but it's really like I'm not probably even really feeling you like that. But if you younger, you don't have a chance. You don't. I don't like younger guys. I've never, I've never liked younger guys. I actually, let me stop lying. I have tried it. But it's just not my thing. It's not for me. Mm. It's my mama's fault. <laughs> I ain't never told nobody about four years older than me. Age ain't a number. I have. Shit. Four years older, yeah. Mm-hmm. I never Shit, told nobody she said four years. Four years. Yeah. Oh, What's the highest on the Nigga, I was 18 and she was knocking out 40. Damn, what? that's some shit. The what? highest I did was about 29, 30. They don't even be looking at me. I swear to God, they don't. I was, I was looking at me. No, they don't even look at me. Since I was yay high, I was 20 and she was 34. Yeah, you got to Yeah, mine's yeah, is only like a 10 but year. But you don't look older. 10 year age. Hell yeah. no. They be thinking I'm young as hell. Not back then. Uh, I was about to say, hell no. Yeah, I'm not 18. I'm not none of that shit. All right, I'm looking at right now. They still be me. They still be carving me type shit. They be thinking I'm like 21. They think I'm 16. You know, I think I, I get a pass everything. They see the blue light on my ID every time. I think it's my age. It's my age. It's my number, bro. Yeah, that shit the blue light. Yeah, true. You look good. You hear me? Thank you. 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 Thank you.
right. Our next question is, what makes you feel lie. appreciated? I'm sorry. What? Sorry, bro. We might have to add my nigga day money to the motherfucking cast, bro. Yeah, every time we do it, he will hurt his face. He's angry. He's good. I'm trying to tell you. You like to be an original cast member. I do it. 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 Like, if you're thinking about me, you're like, oh, I've seen this, and I thought about you. That'd be like, oh, you thought about me? Mm-hmm. That makes me feel appreciated. Appreciate it. You don't need niggas, that When niggas acknowledge the things that I do. Oh, yeah. Like, even even if it's, like, on the limb of me, not even, like, mm-hmm. consciously doing some shit, and they be like, damn, I appreciate you for, you know what I'm saying, doing this yeah. type shit. Even when I okay. wasn't thinking about That's it. That's a good one. That's a real good one. Yeah. yeah. Because, like, you ain't even trying. Nah. I ain't even trying. I don't yeah. even know. Make you feel appreciated. Yeah, I'm kind of stuck here. <laughs> you know, let me tell you, I don't know. I feel like you want to know something. <laughs> when I compliment a person, they say appreciate it. I don't like that. <laughs> but it kind of depends on like the content. Like, I say it when you though. say that. It's like I always say that shit. Yeah, it's not nothing to it though. Yeah, like, it's like the context. Oh uh, yeah. yeah, I say thank you sometimes, mm-hmm. but I say, say appreciate it more. Say thank you. I say it more. Mm-hmm. I say it more. Mm-hmm. Appreciate it. Mm-hmm. You don't say me that. No, because it. <laughs> you feel me? I appreciate it. Why, why, why is that wrong, so bro? Like, appreciate it. Right. You're like, bitch, what? Yeah, that's <laughs> what I, mean. yeah, I appreciate I mean, it. I don't know. I don't say that. I always say, like, thank you. I say content. It's for content. So. I don't know. I don't know what makes me feel appreciated. I don't know. Yeah. Mm-hmm. I don't know. You know what I appreciate about you? Well, so if y'all ain't got y'all, because you wouldn't be hesitant at this point. Yeah. Well, well. For yours, <laughs> I would say I would say how blunt you are for I ain't gonna yeah, care. Yeah, that's because cause everybody's not like that. that. Nope. Everybody ain't cut it's, like that. It's so hard for me not to because at that time, like, I'm going to have, I'm going to spiral do, out. <laughs> man, <laughs> I don't know. One thing that you do, bro, if something rubs you wrong, I that have shit to. is going to get voiced. Like I'm, I'm kind of laid I back with it to. until it get to a, a, an extent where you like disrespect mm-hmm. yeah, like, me. Kind yeah, of shit. Yep, yep. I but have I to because like at that shoot, moment, yeah. at that moment, it's just like I can't because it's like, bro, okay, because it's gonna show and then you gonna feel it. And then when you ask me, it's like, okay, now nah, I really gotta, you know. So I'm ready to tell you on the spot. I'm ready to tell you on the spot, and I'm not even gonna sit here and waste. I'm not even gonna waste your time, and I damn sure ain't gonna waste mine. So I'm gonna just tell you all Like, let me tell you this though. Sometimes it can come off as a little, you know, it comes off as a it's not, lot, always, it's not always what you say is how you say it sometimes. Yeah, yeah. So if you able to articulate whatever you about to say before you do it, that's that'll why, be ten times. That's better. a that's a reason why I do not like arguing. Like I will give you that fight back, but I really don't like to because I know how I can get. Like I know I can say some things out of anger. I can admit that. One thing I feel like I don't have a problem with is admitting things like mm-hmm. being accountable. Being held accountable for, for shit. Oh, you just hit that right on the. Everybody cannot be held accountable or take accountability. I feel I like that I can shit. Take if you know you're wrong, just say you're wrong. Will I apologize right that instant? No, because I'm a stubborn motherfucker and I can mm-hmm. admit that too. But when this when it's time when it's when I when I'm ready, you I will definitely do, do it. Because what if it's the other person? And they well, doing the same thing. You to doing. me, I feel like normally if I don't apologize right on the spot, it's because I'm trying to take a breather for myself. And I feel like at that moment, if I t- if I try to apologize to you and I'm still heated, it's gonna get right yeah, back to where calm, it was at. Let me calm down. I, I, I definitely, I am a person. Cool I can, cause I can hold on to some shit and they just be like, no, I ain't there yet. So mm-hmm. let me cool down and regroup myself, and then we can I have can't that conversation. Say that. Like it's that's not just, a lot that bothers me now, bro. So if a nigga was to ever try to get hostile with me, bro, I'm not gonna lie, I'll probably be at the same little level I am right now. Bro, what you hollering for? And then when you say that to them, they'd be like, even more mad. I'd be like, like, why you not turning us with me? It's not accomplishing accomplishing shit, bro. Like, just chill. Let me hear you. But that's how how you feel some shit, too, though. Yeah, Yeah. it's literally so easy. And that's why I be trying to be a leader whenever niggas arguing, but. When niggas not listening, bro, ain't no point in me talking. I ain't gonna cap. I ain't finna sit here and keep wasting my breath. If I right. feel I'm adamant on it and I'm right, it won't. It, it ain't getting there. Unless I'm at a point where I'm just like, you know what, bitch, you can have that shit. I got my sayings off. As long as I, I get do, my bro. motherfucking words off. If a motherfucker <laughs> just keep motherfucking doing something or talking to you in my face or something like that, bro, I'm gonna just stare at their ass so it's blank, like bro. Crazy. What are you know. talking about right now? They be killing them, bro. It's all like, 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 why are you talking like that? I don't that? give a fuck how you looking at me. Once I say what I gotta say, boom, we done, nigga. Yeah, <laughs> you you gonna, you gonna run out of shit and you gonna be like, why the fuck you staring at me? Like, yeah, like, yeah. Like, yeah. What? what? After, yeah, after I'm done, I said. Yeah. That's like, do you got something you want to say? Bro, once you got the one up, 
Bro, yeah. if I ever get a nigga out the <laughs> element, I know I won. Like, if I'm if I'm talking to you like this, mm-hmm. and you are uh, rah rah. Yes, that's another thing. That's, that's, you, that's, we uh, have one, a conversation. that's one thing I want to learn about myself. Like, I haven't been into it. Like, you one, I noticed on um, July first when we went to your new house. I feel like that is the most I've ever just been like so angry, and that's how I fucked my phone up. That's when I realized I'm like, you tweaked the fuck out. But at, at that moment, I had to. Like, that was just something. That it just it just triggered so many things. It was like I can't, Man, I couldn't, I I'm couldn't do it. And that's myself, why I was bro. so and like and when I was we at the house. Story time about that. I when I was at the house, I felt so calm. Mind. Like I swear to God, I feel like I was not as mad as oh, hyped as I was. Yeah, oh but once God. I got here, that the shit. Was thing, yeah, the only thing that saved those niggas that day. I'm trying to get picked up. Wait, was at Auntie Geneva house. I swear to God, I'm like, I feel like. Anywhere else, I would have crashed out. Then when I say if you would have seen that shit, you probably would have been like, what the fuck is going on? Nigga, I just called. I'm like, wait, yeah, you was drunk again. Yeah, I'm like, I'm like, I'm sorry. I had to apologize. I'm sorry. It was so much. And then I didn't even notice my phone was cracked. That's the crazy part. You got to do a story time for y'all, bro. That was crazy. Nip shit in the bud and then get y'all up. Updated on what we talking about because it's an insider kind of thing. Yeah, yeah, we have to do a story definitely. time for y'all for sure. Definitely. But depending on how long this will go. Depending on how long this will go. Depending on how long this will go, we can do it after this if y'all want to, just to have that way it's another thing that we already got out so that way we can kind of delay. Closing yeah. that out. What you was about to say? Yeah, you know, you're because we're going to keep on talking about that okay. shit. <laughs> what you want to go next question? What did you feel? What makes you feel appreciated? No, what was you about to say? That's what oh. I was saying. About Jordan? Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. What do you appreciate about Bree? I mean, B. <laughs> I'm able to, uh, you that little brother I need for real. Because I feel like it's too many women in the family. Yeah. And whenever I'm talking, bro, like it's not hitting like it should sometimes. So whenever I'm talking to this nigga, it's like talking to myself for real. You want to know? You feel me? I'm sorry to cut you off. Something I appreciate about y'all. It's just I like when y'all are able to talk about the stuff y'all do because it's like for for me I can't do that but I'm perfectly fine with that like I don't mind like hearing y'all tell tell me about girls like it just it just does not make me be like ill like why are y'all saying that to I me I just think, I, I just think, think it's so girl, cool because it's yeah. just like damn y'all really get the you know like I don't want to be a boy one for twenty four hours <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you I swear to God twenty four hours I could just turn into a boy. Most <laughs> <laughs> I had a time of my life. Yeah, just breathe all kinds yeah. of moves, nigga. No hair. Yeah. <laughs> like yeah. single to Mayo. Yeah. They was pussy footing on that day. Man, y'all, that shit you see, so they were in my. I'm like that every time. Every time we go, I will give her on a bitch so with a quickness. Yeah. I don't give her on a bitch. I will give her on a bitch so that. hard. Like, I don't give a fuck. Please, if I don't know you, I am. I think that ass I'm going to get behind you. Nigga, I'm talking about a five on and five. And me, bro, nigga. look, bro. We had a turn some shit like that, up. bro. I'm going to put that shit on the floor. I don't give a fuck, bro. If niggas is playing around with some shit, bro, I'm going to put that shit on the floor. And even this is the thing, bro. Everybody be so selfish. Bro. Like, let's say that, that five on five was lined up. And I, I damn near knew I couldn't get no, you know what I'm saying? I'm going to still go because, damn, everybody else, yeah. every, the whole yeah. team trying to win. The whole time you and that bitch throwing them. Man, the team trying to win. Like, what y'all yeah. doing? That would have been the whole after party. That'd be five on five. Bro. Everybody could have attacked some. Niggas just don't got game. It ain't Same about thing. that sometimes, bro. Nigga, we that, that, was, that was a yeah. motherfucking uh, clash. Yeah, up, nigga. That was a motherfucking clash. That's, that's what I'm saying. That's a tournament, nigga. That's why I feel like I'm going to come out of the Because if I was still doing that, And nigga, ain't nobody. It look. Ain't nobody taking it from the team, bro. Well, nobody taking the L, bro. No ill. Yeah. Like, nobody take one for the time. I knew who I wanted. That's the thing. I knew who I wanted. I'm like, oh, yeah. I'm on that. I went up my one. I'm like, I don't know what y'all niggas, but I'm about to stay. Hell, yeah. yeah that's yeah. why I'm like, come on, y'all. Come over here and then shit. Bring the crowd to us. Mm. All right. Next question. What is one thing you learned this week? This week? Yeah. What are you? I'm going to take care of myself because don't nobody else. Shit, the fans yeah. about you. Yeah. Niggas gotta learn Especially that for sure. Especially working yourself to death. Yeah. Ain't nobody coming to save y'all, bro. Save yep. yourself. Save yourself. Ain't nobody yourself coming to save. I definitely learned that. No, exactly. It's weak. Nobody gonna pull it's your sweet. hand through it. Ain't nobody gonna do it. I know it, but it's like it went into full. I agree right. with yeah. that. Yeah, like, you know. One thing I learned this week is you gotta apply yourself, man. You gotta buckle down. 
gotta stop procrastinating. Close out the distractions, man. Yes. It's, time, it's, it's time, easy. It's, it's, time it's easy over up, time. Bro. I'm trying to tell y'all, bro. That shit is so up. easy. Yeah. That shit is so shit easy. That you think it's so hard and insurmountable, bro. It's not. It's not easy. Yeah. Like, just cut yeah, it out. Just go cold turkey, bro. That's why I be telling everybody all the time, like, if they trying to quit something, just like with y'all with Breeze and shit, I'm like, bro, just stop that shit, nigga. Next time you down, go think about it, next down, time you get a Breeze, bro, nigga, throw that shit out the window, bro. <laughs> just like, nigga, be done with that shit. Just this like, is cut it out thing. the window. I don't, that's one thing, I, I, I can pick anything up and put it right back down. I'm drinking, I can stop tonight and not have to get another one. Weed, I can put that shit down and not have to get another one. Right. A breeze, I don't have to do. I was on breezes before, like, back then, yeah. Now, absolutely not. Drink, if I'm drinking, yeah, that I do it. And, and a given day, if it's a Tuesday, no, fuck yeah. that. I'm not doing that shit. I don't need to. It's not, it's not my, that's not my thing. Like, I'm not into it no more. I think it's it was just easy, man. something it I was into on, at one point. It depends on how vigorous your mind is, bro. If you really tell well, yourself that my mind and my body is weaker than this, you're going to lose right every time. Yeah. You feel lose, bro. You gonna lose every time. Yeah. You gotta, you gotta tell yourself, matter. nigga, I'm stronger than this. You gotta, yeah, you just I'm gotta, better than this. You just gotta replace your habits <laughs> with better ones. Like running my family and shit, I'm kind of, I don't, I feel like I don't. You nervous? Mm. -mm. I feel like I got it. I feel like I got it. Okay, good. Thank you. We're gonna learn this week, man. I'm yeah. learning. I'm still in the in the process of learning how to observe my thoughts. Mm. You know, so not not acting upon them, but yeah. actually observing them, and then actually, you know what I'm saying. Not letting it take over or recalibrate anything that I'm doing. You feel me? Because you know you're not showing every thought. Sometimes yeah. they just they just thoughts. Just in there. You are what you in there. attach yourself to. Most definitely. You attach so, yourself do to. Do y'all believe in um, manifestation? Mm -hmm. Yeah, but yeah. you gotta believe it. Yeah, yeah. That shit hard yeah. though, bro. It, that shit work, easier bro. said than done. Like, it definitely is. It definitely is. It definitely is. You can't just speak the shit and not do it, bro. Yeah, it's yeah. Not, it's not, it's not never gonna work if you that just action, bro. keep bro. saying it. Maybe my manifestation is something like, look, like the more and more you actually say it, the more it's gonna be in your head, so the more you gonna actually do it. Feel me? Like that's the whole. And it all come with discipline, bro. And when you when you discipline yourself to do something and you adamant about it and you determine that you are gonna get whatever you gonna get done nigga ain't nothing gonna stop you that's how i be feeling in the gym bro when i go to the gym i be feeling like i can step on niggas heads i swear to god, <laughs> you know, I, swear to god. I actually love going to the gym at first <laughs> i used to be so subconscious about going to the gym and that'd be the thing too ain't nobody looking and that's, at yeah, that's yeah that's what yeah. you guys think about nobody looking at y'all like that's like, like that's a so human thing though yeah, so yeah. Yeah. Just get that shit out your head and then i be at the gym like that bitch a concert niggas be looking at me i'm like nigga Damn, I'm piped up, especially once I'm pumping, nigga. I'm pumping. <laughs> Ooh, you better not even yeah, look at me wrong, nigga. I swear she to God. is like you one person I know. Like I could at first I used to like I don't know. You should just be nervous because to me I feel like I'm weak as shit. Like mm -hmm. lifting is definitely something I can like add ground to it. But like going with you is just like I feel comfortable. Like I don't feel like like if I can't if. I know you say don't say can't, but like fun player, I just can't do it. I'm just, I'm just gonna tell somebody, okay, try again next time, or just go down, go down the pound. Don't you know your brain is a lot stronger than your body. Yeah. Once you believe in your brain, your body gonna follow suit. Yeah. Hey, if y'all wanna get with me in the lab, man. I need to get there. Get with me. I'm gonna start doing yeah. vlogs for sure. Yeah. Cause I be got niggas. <laughs> <I'm> <laughs> you, but you can get that little bicep tone. For yeah, I'm sure. trying to get up in there. I'm down there about to be a personal trainer, yeah. bro. Let me know yeah. if y'all trying to get in that lab. Get y'all yeah, be saying y'all hip snatch or y'all waist snatch or whatever. Waist <laughs> snatch, yeah. I definitely need a waist snatch and a bigger butt. So I don't want nothing else. I don't care. Anything else you guys want to add? What did you learn this week, dude? Uh, what I learned this week? Yeah. <clears throat> Just uh, really strategizing, bro. So like having stuff planned out and actually executing on it as efficiently as possible, bro. Yeah, sure. Feel me? Cause like if you if you gotta plan something out, bro, and it's and you know it's coming up and you know it's ahead and stuff, just strategize. Stay. Yeah, yeah, you gotta you keep thinking like it's far away or I got time. Really ain't got no time. You ain't yeah. doing that shit ASAP. You gotta execute, bro. Yeah. I agree. Stay ready. I be doing that. I love you guys' answers. I love them. I love them all of them. I love that for you guys. Um. What is one word that describes you? Do you think we should do this for? I think we should low key do this one for each other. I think we can do both. Okay. Cause I got a word for me. Okay, what's your myself. word? Let's go like that. Like. Ooh, I had to pick one. Yeah. 
I would say altruistic. This is this is the whiz kid over here. <laughs> <laughs> right, right. This shit can get way. This shit can get way this better, bro. This ain't, this this ain't nothing right is, now. Um, Giapedia. <laughs> <laughs> I swear to God. I swear to God, you need a word. He got one yeah, for you. This shit can get better though. Oh man. my goodness. But altruism is is caring for one's one's own self, like more than mine. You know what I'm saying? So putting other people before, before yourself. Basically you know, like being empathetic. And let me, before we even get to the next thing, you know it's not always good to do that because when you put people before yourself, yeah, you, leave it, yourself it, it, you leave yourself yeah. hanging all the time. And you always, 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 I don't care if nobody agrees with this, but I feel like you always still going to be reaching out for that one person. To, to give you that back, to show you that. Supercation, most yeah, definitely. You Anybody that's going to tell that. you otherwise is lying. And I feel that all the time. That. You I always going to always gonna yearn for that that caring and that um, mm. that drive. Like That's always going to be something in the back of your mind. You know, which I agree. I feel the same way. I feel like I'm a, I'm a person that care for others. Mm. Even if even if you don't care about me, it's, I, I feel like I think about a lot of people. Even if they don't feel that way, I think I do all the time. I think I'm, a, I'm one of the not to you know to my own horn, but I feel like I really am a, a caring person. Mm-hmm. Really, yeah, should be, bro. It's All genuine. human beings. If we was put on this earth to do the one thing, if we was able to serve the purpose that we was here for, bro. This motherfucker be so beautiful. Yeah, absolutely. This motherfucker be so beautiful. <laughs> I agree, Dylan. Uh, wait, the one word I would describe for you. I want to describe you. I would say intelligent. Uh, you so wise. I would say you're, <laughs> yeah. very, you're a very you intelligent so person. Wise. You definitely mm-hmm. are, like, so different from what, like, because, like, growing up with y'all, like, not to say, like, it's a bad thing, but I feel like I just did not expect us to turn out this way. Like, I would not, uh, like, seeing you like this. Like, I feel like you're still quiet, but you're definitely, like, outspoken. Like, you don't have to say something, but it's already, like, just there. Like, you already know. Like, you can't come to you a certain way. Like, you just already know. Like, when you come, like, when we come to you, it's more like, okay, I know I can really get a real perspective from him. I know I can get something that's mm-hmm. genuine when I'm asking this question. And there's no, like, judgment there behind it. You know what I'm saying? Yes, I would definitely say you're a very intelligent person. You think before you just go do you know, I feel like the maturity is definitely there with the, all of y'all, but I definitely say like it's just there with you. Like everybody just knows, like okay, this is G, this is come like this, not so serious, but you know, like that. Our business, man. Yeah. Yeah, when you think of intelligence, mm-hmm. Brian, what you think? Mm-hmm. One word to describe G G. G. I would say. I would really say optimistic, bro. Mm, because if it's some, if it's something that you really adamant about, and you exactly. and you believe in, like you definitely gonna act upon that shit. Like you really gonna go for that shit. Like it's damn near, it's damn near like like motivating, bro. You feel me? So like I can bounce back off of that type of like yeah. it pushed me to go harder type shit. You know. I hope like, you don't put a lot of pressure on me. Yeah. Yeah. In a way, in a way, cause only only cause I know, I ain't gonna say I, I'm an idol, but at the same time, I'm I'm that figure that y'all you know yeah. kind of pursue. Yeah, anyway. that's why, yeah, so, that's why I say like I hope you don't put too much pressure. On it's me. not too much, cause I know everybody go down they they own avenues at the end of the day. So I gotta let y'all be who y'all are. But as long as y'all love yourselves and what y'all doing, I'm all for it. You feel me? So I know at the end of the day. You ain't doing nothing but serving your own purpose. Cause that's the that's the whole destiny of life. Like you figure out what you was meant to be here for, bro. Shit beautiful. Once you find it, and then you don't want to do nothing but that. You feel me? So I'm all for it. Y'all like it, I love it. Two, 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 two. Um, I would say one word to describe myself. I'm just gonna go with caring. That's that's just I feel like I'm just that kind of person. Like I'm very as mean as people say, and which I can be mean, but I feel like I'll be mean. I feel like really, truly, deep down inside, it's really just me caring about caring you too hard. so mm-hmm. much, you yeah, to where it's yourself. like, yeah, yeah, yeah. You know, because I feel like if I'm not, if I'm not picking at you, it's like <laughs> I don't fuck with you. I don't believe you're like a person. You yeah. make sure everybody's <clears throat> care for sure. So, 
and stay on their pee. Yeah, I'm talking about ass, bro. But <laughs> I be needing it. Yeah, I'm about to say that's the type of shit she needs, bro. Yeah, yeah if somebody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm saying. Anybody that's going to tell you about your shit, that's what I'm you can adapt to your your surroundings. Yeah, okay, well. yeah, okay. You yeah. and be for real. That's something I admire about y'all too. I'm not gonna lie, cause I'm I'm putting around a group of people. Like I gotta get the feel of the room before I'm able to act upon who I want to maneuver around and all that kind of stuff. Yeah. I see y'all okay. do that shit, and it's kind of like, okay, damn. Maybe I need to start doing the same thing. You feel me? Because yeah. you never know who you might meet at that point. Mm-hmm. Yeah, that's how I used to feel about. That's how I used to feel about you, B. But I think it just took me a little time to get older. And to kind of have like my own like um, like set of friends and mm-hmm. not just be so much in a shadow. Just with, like going to school with you and how close in age you were, and then people knew that we were siblings. I think I had to just see that for myself because I used to always say that about you, like, did, did he just go so much? He just have so many outgoing friends. But then for me, it was just like, oh, this is just Brian's little sister, and I didn't have that. This is already this is. But I, at that time, I was just like, like your own identity. Yeah, 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 yeah. So. I mean, yeah, that's that's how I was growing up, though. Because, like, you know how we all went to Carver, nigga. Yeah. I was always G, little brother, Mari, little brother. I always, he was always that. Yeah. Not even my name. Yeah, you feel me? Like, I wasn't even myself. So, but around my peoples, I was, though. So, like, yeah. I don't know. I feel like it just trickled down once you, you mm-hmm. know. Once you figure out who you yeah, is, for sure, like, man. How your friends be with Deja type of yeah, yeah and that's you want to know something I always try to let anytime I'm around Deja I always try to let her have her own thing just because I already know it's like in the family you get played down enough as is and I would hate to be in the situation she in because it's just oh, like oh shit speaking of my nigga Deja bro we gonna have to get her on here for oh, sure no, that ain't definitely gotta get her mm-hmm. it's just like and that's why we tell, that's why I was sure. so adamant on introducing y'all to Deja because Deja she met Deja the, already yeah, well, she we okay, yeah, went out to yeah, everything. To say, Deja is literally she her. she a tourist. That's my tourist mm-hmm. twin. I love Deja to death, and I just want her to to be able to have her own voice for once. Man. Like, that's my only thing. I'm, I'm trying so to tell you, about. once she break down that wall, it's over. It's just with. like yeah, and she's slowly so, but surely and there's no her turning. Sure. Yeah, there's no turning her back, and I would be so I cannot wait to see Deja and her element like that, and I would just cheer her on so hard, so Man. hard. Cause she already embracing all of the shit that she she intrinsically do. You feel me? So at that point, yeah. once she starts just not giving a fuck, yeah, and that's what it's gonna take. Is, it's gonna take to have to take not, it or leave it's it. Have that's to how niggas gotta be, bro. Leave some yeah. motherfuckers behind, it. and that's what. Yeah, take it or leave it. You gonna like it or you gonna love me, man? Mm-hmm. Either way, I'm gonna be myself, regardless I of what the fuck you agree. think. Agree. You know, I definitely agree with that. I, I can't wait for Deja to find that with herself. And not have to please people because she's so young and she has to do what they say and it's an order or like a demand and not really a choice. It's like everybody goes through that too. Yeah, so I already she yeah she yeah she is yeah yeah yeah. Black children definitely. Were you silent or were you silent? Drop drop that up and what's being taken there. Silenced for sure, nigga. It want no back talk, nigga. They just, they say you go put that chair up. You be like, damn, why I gotta? Dang, nigga, go put that chair up. Fuck you like, about? Shit, I just yeah. wanna know. Like, fuck. <laughs> like, goddamn, you couldn't question shit. Boy, Man, that's what they don't do. Don't let them. you find something. Um, you know, don't let you go find something. You don't see it. Nah, if I go over there and go by myself, man, you might be seeing myself out of nowhere, bro. How are you threatening me? Because I can't oh, find your shit. Like, this is, this is your shit. How are you threatening me? I didn't me flip this head. whole room upside down about three, four times. Because I know what you're about to tell me. I didn't flip this room so many times, and then you they just go come up, up there, there. straight. They like, straight bro, up. nigga, I just right looked here. over there six times, bro. Like, how did you just <laughs> pull this shit out? They be thinking you bullshitting the whole time. Like, bro, I wouldn't have came up here if I was really being that bitch amazed at you. Man, I'm like, like, bro, what? Now my ass is grass. Man, the whole time, her phone, and they upstairs, like, damn, don't find that bitch. Please, Please don't find it. <laughs> rare, they don't find it. Rare as Real, rare, rare as hell. I don't even remember that. Okay, Jaylen, one word to describe you. And I would tell you, you I'd say Jaylen, like, oh my god, you made my mom! 
my whole life, I ain't never did nothing that was not like in my heart. Oh my heart. god, I never did y'all! I literally think we are the same yeah. person because sometimes was, it might be in the ass, but I know like energy energy like energy is very important. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Like, 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 so even if I do something for you and it don't be reciprocated, the energy she is perfectly gonna fine with back. that. Yeah, it's gonna come back when I least expect it or when I really need it. Yeah, Honestly, she is definitely genuine. Oh my mm. god, I can't believe <laughs> <laughs> But seeing so much shit, yeah. seeing like just being around certain things and growing up in certain environments, I feel like I had to be genuine. You know? Yeah, because you could be a major yeah. bitch. Mm-hmm. Be a major bitch. Yeah, or just seeing yeah. the shit. Just knowing her yeah. like yeah. background, y'all. Yeah. Uh, she could be a major mm-hmm. bitch if she wanted to. But I just Everybody, feel like it was it's it. crazy, bro. That's yeah. why I'm so glad no people choice, embrace who they it are, is, bro. That shit is so beautiful. Because yeah. it's like when, when people try to construct who they want you to be, bro. You ain't gonna never be happy for yourself. I try to do that too. Like, be, be somebody you. else somebody wanted to be. You know, that shit eat your ass up at the end of the day. You gotta face yourself at the end of the day. Yeah. Because once once it's all said and done, you don't really person there for you. So, mm-hmm. yeah. Yeah. Fuck what they tell you. Might as well do you. Yeah. I would say that, like, authentic means authentic. I'm gonna get their money whimsical. Gmpedia. <laughs> <laughs> like that yeah, word, I mean, she's she always full of life, man. It's always a motherfucking vibe when they around, man. It's never a dull moment. I ain't never seen day around yeah. and like the house just like quiet like it usually is. You feel me? <laughs> like you don't know when she in this bitch. Yeah, this, this is one person that you know lives life like there's no tomorrow. I'm I'm trying. Trying. Literally, I didn't try because I've been around that depression. Oh my yeah. god. Yeah. 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 Yeah, you come shit on your whole like, motherfucking yeah, demeanor. I didn't, bro, and you know what's crazy? <laughs> you, you can be having the that. best day, and it only takes one sentence for a nigga to fuck up your whole mm-hmm. day. That's so crazy to me. Yep. Yeah. That's so crazy that to me. Do it, yeah, I definitely agree. I can't. I agree. You only get like, what, 84,000 or 86,000 seconds in a day? Can't let nobody fuck it up. 84, 000, yeah. Something like that, yeah. Don't let, like, five seconds fuck your shit up. Yeah. I try not to do that. All right. BB. I don't want to say the same thing. Be the young and OG. Yeah, because I was always myself, and I didn't didn't give a fuck, bro. Like, Um, if you do this... I'm yeah. always be me at the end of the day. I would yeah, definitely say a word is authentic. Yeah, yeah. yeah. I feel like Brian's always yeah. been his, just his, his self, you know? As much as me and Brian were bigger, I just always want to be like Brian. <laughs> no lie, I swear to God. So hard to admit. It's like, I'm just kidding. <laughs> but yeah, no, definitely for real. Sometimes I used to always be like, damn, what if we were twins? <laughs> so much easier. <laughs> so much easier. Oh, yeah. what I like about you too, you gonna do, you gonna do your shit too. Like, especially with your color brown. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That's the take a lot. Going there. Yeah. Mm-hmm. yeah. And your shit sweet too. Appreciate it. Yeah, Appreciate definitely. It. Starting something out from the bottom. It's yeah. Definitely, it'll definitely get you there. That shit run like you down with you. Fuck. Still going. Yeah. yeah. And not everybody want to do that shit. Mm-hmm. Hell yeah. And you still going. Yeah. Uh, I feel like, like, stand out like certain, you. yeah, certain stuff like that, I just feel like. If I gotta be that person to, to, to do something, bro, so everybody will follow suit, shit. I gotta be that way, bro. Mm-hmm. And you ain't scared of no cop either. Can't be, man. Can't be. Mm-hmm. Can't. Well, you can't, but everybody can't like that, yeah. though. Like, niggas see shit as cop, bro. Mm-hmm. I don't see shit as cop. I feel like it's enough He's money and everything out, out there. Time. Everybody, yep. That's the mentality. <laughs> so, I, I feel like if niggas, if ordinary niggas that I know are below me, this ain't no disdain or nothing like that, bro. But if I know niggas that are beneath me can do it, I got every niggas out here get rich for doing absolutely nothing, anything, bro. I was just telling all I'm like, look at fucking JoJo see y'all. We got the same age. Bitch got rich off bows. Bows. <laughs> Hair ties, Literally. Bro. Hair ties. Literally. That's, that's really part of the reason I started this. She sold her about bro. like 90 million of them because bitches. Because of the fact, I know, I know so many people. And I know so many talented motherfuckers, bro. Like, nigga, y'all should be doing this, bro. Yeah, I am talented, motherfuckers. It's like, it, bro. It's like I'm, I feel like, like I'm a visionary. Like, I can see the potential in other people mm-hmm. type stuff. And I can, like, bring it out of them type stuff. Most definitely. So, like, 
Whatever it is, bro. That's why I try to be like a jack of all trades for real, for real, bro. So if I know a little bit of something, I can push you on to something, and then we can just make it blossom from there, bro. Definitely. That's what I like about everybody, too. Like, everybody in here, if y'all find a way, y'all gonna put everybody else on. Everybody not gonna do that. They gonna Man, make sure they eat, niggas, and you, 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 you on your own. Yeah, yeah, you yeah, on yeah. your own. I try not yeah. to be a yeah. selfish person. Mm-hmm. See, that's and that's how you lose, bro. That's how you lose, bro. That's how you lose, bro. That be the thing, bro. That be the downfall, though. Every, every Everybody can't be the captain mm-hmm. of the ship, bro. This nigga gotta pull the road. This nigga gotta, you gotta know sell, bro. You gotta, you gotta know your road. Everybody gotta. And don't try to outshine yeah. the master, bro. Yeah. 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 Don't yeah. ever discredit the person that started it. I will mm-hmm. be overstepping your bounds. You, you. you. you gotta yeah. know who you are Never. until you Never. get there. Like, what, let yourself get there before yeah. you start yeah. shitting on other people and all that. Like, yeah. nigga, I know everything. I'm the most humble motherfucker, bro. So I know mm-hmm. exactly when I'm gonna shit on niggas, when I'm gonna stay back and be quiet and all of that shit. I always felt, bro. I'm a humble beast, bro. I'm a humble beast. I'll never let that shit so unless I really want to, but oh, yeah. now, and you gonna feel it. You gonna feel that shit when I pop out, I swear to God. Y'all gonna feel that. That's why I be saying. To describe bro. B. You never said it. Yeah. I said opportunistic. Mm-hmm. See that shit he on me. It's like no. <laughs> <laughs> um the next question is let what? me know if y'all fucking with this one, bro. This bitch a banger. Yeah, 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 this is a really this good question. Thank you, thank you. Mm-hmm. Thank you. Thank you. I I feel like, bro, I love this type of shit, bro. I'm yeah, saying. I think it's so important. This conversation is really bringing in the love. Man. Not only that, that it's just big, it just, um, and then not only that, it just lets us know each other just like on a deeper level, you know what I'm saying? And that's what I've been saying for the longest, bro. Just to put a smile on each other. Even though we blood, it's not a lot that I can say about niggas and be very earnest about it. Like, it's not a lot that I know. Like, because we all grow up and we different people now. Right. It's a lot of niggas in our family I don't know shit about. Sure. Like, besides the shit that they didn't, they didn't put out on the table from when we was young and shit didn't change since then. So, like, yeah. your favorite color could have been yellow when we was growing up. That shit might be orange now. You feel me? Mm-hmm. True that, true that, so, true that. That's why I just be wanting to have these profound right. conversations with niggas. But if you're not willing to have it, I ain't going to pull your arm or nothing like that. But this shit be like this, bro. And we doing it for free right now. So imagine when that motherfucking that motherfucking <laughs> TD star coming in. Oh that's my right. god, bro. That's all I be saying. I just like yeah. the progress and the journey. Man, the journey, so right. beautiful. This shit be so beautiful. Yeah. So I be saying they say it's beauty start, and a struggle, you nigga. You gotta start so from somewhere. Because look where we at right now. I give it a year Literally. from now, bro. Yeah, it's not gonna be, be appreciated a little, bro. Literally. Literally. Because that's how I feel about like how our house is was. That's why I tell people all the time. Because a lot of people from the way I talk, they think I automatically grew up in the suburban area. But if you really knew, like, how from where we <laughs> came some from, some dogs, we man. were definitely not, we did not, and, and we just had a mama yeah, that just knew how to make it <laughs> look good, pill, like, man. to keep it at least, you know, some of, something up to part, you know, some shit might be falling apart, but at least we got this working right now, we'll work on that next, feel me? that's the next you thing, feel me? that's progress. not just cry about everything, that's all like, stagnant, man. You gotta move. Journey, cause like, what's that quote saying, like, a man that, uh, enjoy the journey. Further than the man who breaks destination. Mm. Mm. Real, shit, real. real shit, man. You gotta see that next step before you mm-hmm. see the whole time. I could literally be a talk show host. Yeah. <laughs> I swear to God. But you can't look at every real. step either. Like, like the whole That's one thing I did say when I was step. younger, bro. Like, I used to look up to Martin and shit, bro. I used to never get talked about. That shit bro. easy being an entertainer, bro. That shit is easier than you think. Really you can get famous off the smallest shit. You'll be no surprised. No shade, but look at Sukiyana and them niggas. Man, niggas, that's, that's just that, no that's shade. That's the epitome example. of why yeah, I wanted to do this. I'm like, bro, there's no way. Mm-hmm. People get famous no that, way. That type of shit come at a different price. I feel like... This the organic morals, way. This is, yeah. this is why I fuck with Herb so much. Niggas bro. lose their morality. He's not an industry yeah. plant. Yeah. He got that shit out the mud and he's still stepping on niggas, bro. Mm-hmm. No industry money, no none of that. And what's Real you solid your nigga. Your cook? Man. Like a a solid nigga, nigga that slow grind, bro. Mm-hmm. I'm Absolutely. all for it. I ain't trying to take no shortcuts or nothing like that, bro. What's that nigga yeah. Boom Gang? Nah. Look at his ass. Boom. Cook this motherfucker. Oh, yeah. Where is mm-hmm. it? Who's Boot Gang? Uh, boom. You know who that nigga Boot Gang used to steal shit. Nigga used to do how like that. Oh, Boot Gang! <laughs> 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 I don't forget about that. Like, niggas, lobster, he want niggas like, to take him fuck? serious and they don't do it no more. Because once you come out the gate, well, once you come out the gate with this, yeah, that's, 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 that's your perception. Yeah, yeah, and, that's, and that's why Sukiyana now getting the respect she wants right now. Because it's like, 
you been you on videos. You know for niggas booty. Yeah, you, know for, hungry, you know for eating huh? booties, uh, porn. You know for you making the music. You <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That's just what you're known that's for. So it's hard. hard. It's hard yeah. for people to look at you as something different because that's yep. how you display yourself. Them Disney like, stars. Yeah. Zendaya made it out though. Yeah. And she that's because slim. The, that's because that Zendaya was that was a slim chick. That because it's a, a lot chin. of Disney motherfuckers that's fucked up. Nickelodeons that's fucked up. But Zendaya just got real motherfucking talent. Mm-hmm. That's one bitch I will not never. Take away from y'all niggas need some help, like man. Be shit. yourself. Yeah. What has been y'all a great your greatest accomplishment this year? Think hard, guys. So I'm not being afraid to let go of stuff that I know I need to let go of. Cause I used to be struggling to hold on. Well, maybe this person to change, or maybe this person to treat me right. Yeah, okay. yeah, that's good. This year, this year, I just like fuck it, let go. Doing mm-hmm. shit, bro. Putting action behind my motherfucking words, bro. I swear to God. Mm-hmm. I swear to God. Actually, I ain't been saying, actually acting upon. The I ain't been, been saying shit, and I got a quote for niggas when I started getting that bag in, bro. Because right. It don't mean shit if you gonna keep on talking. That's why I be like, bro, yeah, y'all niggas talking, talking bro. Stop talking. Stop talking about, talking. Stop talking about you, everything. It's not on you, it's in you. Just, just do it do like it. Nike just do said, shit, nigga. Bro. Just do it. My nigga Shia LaBeouf <laughs> said, just do it. <laughs> no hat, bro. Stop talking about shit. Just hey, be no, about that, it. That was my high school quote, bro. If you want something to change bad enough, you gotta do that shit yourself. Bro. Do it. I don't know about your greatest compliment. Because what's gonna be the worst case scenario? Man. But you can always put the then, then when I was a, when I was a young nigga, I seen this quote by Michael Jordan, bro. You miss every shot that you don't, don't take. Most definitely, you miss every one that you don't Man. take, bro. And then you be regretting this shit. You be like, damn, what yeah, if? What niggas if always saying what yeah, if. It's always the what if. What if? What if? What if? Hell yeah. What it could have been? Yeah. That's why you might as well just do it. Just do the Look shit. Look at me. I mean, I feel like I'm a risk taker at times. I don't know. I mean, I don't, I'm the ultimate risk taker, bro. Risk taker, bro. Just how you know, tomorrow ain't promised, bro. Take that risk, bro. Mm-hmm. Go out on that limb. Yeah. Yeah. Worst case scenario, what? I'll pass on Ask yourself that. Well, I think failure don't exist. I think that's in your head. Just learning, nigga. Yeah, so everything's a little sad. That's one thing I hate. I hate failing. Anything. But you should. Don't look at it as a failure. Look at it as a lesson. So I lost the next time. Lesson, I, I hate it. Like, you knock it down, get back up, try again. So much. I hate it so much. Cause I am a person I like to be. Man. I feel like I'm a per- I want to. I'm a perfectionist. Like everything you gotta just fail. has to be. You gotta fail. Yeah, that's how I used to feel, bro. Especially if towards like school work or something oh, like I really felt like I, I did really good yeah. on, bro. And yeah. you just throw that oh, shit in my face bitch. and that shit like, like damn, yeah. bro, for real. You gotta be able to take that's that. That's a human trait. You gotta be able to take that. Yeah. 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 For real. That's one thing college did teach me, bro. Ooh. Them no little assignments that I was, yeah, okay. I, was, boy, I was motherfucking putting my foot in, nigga. Them bitches come back and be like, damn. Yeah, right. that's how Long I feel. <laughs> that's really yeah. how I feel. That's, you know, my first semester, I felt like I was like, damn, this shit was, this was, this was easy breezy. Second semester, I'm like, what the fuck is this, bro? Like, as much as I love the subject, I'm like, why is it? Taking so long, like why is it just not mm-hmm. picking up, man? Like why? Yeah, yeah. I still feel like that. Man. Shout out my baby Miss Really too. She said every level is gonna get harder. Every level is gonna get harder, bro. Don't expect the shit to get easier. It's gonna get harder. Yeah. If it was yeah. easy, everybody would do the shit. Yeah, facts. That's the motherfucking quote I be living with, bro. If this shit was easy, everybody would do it. Mm-hmm. Low key, it is easy. All you gotta do is put the time in. Mm-hmm. Yeah. If you put 20 minutes in every day, you're doing more work than 95% of these niggas, bro. Mm-hmm. I guarantee it. If you actually look and clock your time and what you actually doing every day, bro, you'll be you'll be fucked up over some shit. Just like, bro, I done had to set a time limit on my phone, bro. I was about to say that. Because I swear to God, I looked at that shit one day, bro, and I was on social media and just all this other bullshit for so long. Yeah. Out of yeah. the day when I can be doing this or working towards mm-hmm. this. Mm-hmm. Bro, you feel me? Like spending three, four hours on Instagram just scrolling and shit, bro. Like, no. Bro. Yeah, I think I know and then you go back, you don't even remember what the fuck you did you don't even, this day. You yeah. feel me? Man. Yeah. You trying to timestamp your shit off of life. Like, nigga, no, that's not mm-hmm. gonna work, bro. Mm-hmm. 
Y'all think I'm a walking encyclopedia, bro? That's where that shit come from. Replacing them habits with them. Yeah, replacing yeah. them habits. That bro. shit does That's work. Definitely. Gotta replace them habits. Because everything you, everything you do is a habit. You just oh, gotta definitely. figure out what your habits If they good or bad, yep. you gotta just filter them bitches out. Mm-hmm. Anybody else wanna add any accomplishments? Once, twice, nope. All right. <laughs> Next question is, what was your favorite memory of the last five years? That's last five. Yeah, five. Last five. Then we can I extend was 15 it. years uh, old. 2018 can you extend is the first go back. Extend the time limit. Five. My greatest accomplishment? No, what's your favorite memory? My favorite memory. Your favorite, favorite, memory. favorite memory. Yeah. What's your Dang. favorite memory of the last five years? Mm. I don't know. Oh, yeah. I got one when I was younger. Okay, totally. Like when I was younger, going to the mall with my granddad, taking me to the mall, having like that vibe. Alright, cool, cool, cool. Yeah, I like being able to see us. No, I just wanted to make sure it was still recording. Right. The green lights on. You know what I'm saying? The camera can be on, though. You feel me? Uh, my f- favorite memory in the last five years, honestly, I would say. Hold on, y'all remember shit from five years ago? Five years. I think the first time I remember go back probably. I gotta look at pictures to see, you yeah. feel me, what kind of shit I was in. It gotta be like no. certain things, like you gotta stick out. Man, no, man. man. I can remember these um, shit, bro. But my greatest memory, or favorite memory, not greatest, but favorite memory, was just being able to go out to Ross my house and actually kind of build a somewhat of a bond with her before she passed. Mm. Like I would go over and just like clean her house up for her because she just couldn't like the. She couldn't do all of it and stuff. But it would just be the moments just like sitting down, just, yeah. looking over stuff for her and stuff like that. Just being able to look at her house and just being like, this is it's different. Or just talking to her, seeing how she was. You know, I'd probably say that was my favorite mm, thing. Okay. Just being able to learn somebody that I didn't get a chance to, you know. Because like how y'all got memories of, or like how they got memories of Big Daddy and stuff. I don't have that. I only, literally, Granny is the only person that I can say from a grandparent. Figure that's the only grandparent I have. That's the only grandparent I know of. And then, I don't know. It's just I feel like they got a, a, a whole bunch of, like, stories or life lessons from them that I feel like we I don't get to have like that. So, yeah, that would definitely be my favorite memory. Cause Next that's lifetime, person. though, for sure, because I got to sit down with Grandma Geist for sure. That's one person I embrace to just love off the strength of. I sound great, for real. Yeah. Granny ain't going to let you know shit, though. Granny, too, too she too discreet, man. Grandma. Yeah, and I that's think, that's I think Granny good. got like a little cap on what she let you know. Oh yeah, definitely, of course, definitely, of course. Certain things you can't really break down. That's and get because into. that's because and that'd be the things that I'd be wanting to know. I'd be like, yeah, but I want to get like, into the whole thing. Fuck a little slither of it, nigga. I'm trying to get right. the whole slab. You want to know something? I used to be so close to Granny. Remember, I used to stay over Granny House. Man, and everybody just, just I feel like you just brought it up. Shit. You oh, start to I see the see meretricious it. shit in this family, brother. The older you get, bro, I'm trying to tell you. The more you. stuff you just start to oh see for yourself God. as an It'd adult. Be so crazy. Yeah. And it's not even trying to be on, like, because to me, because I'm not going to say no names, but when I would tell people, like, oh, I don't, I don't, I don't look at that person the same way you look at them, it's all because of stuff in the past. Not to say that I'm holding on to it, but it's just like, when you said this, this made me feel this way. So it's always going to stick out sure. because it's just like, how could, I, how could I not remember that? Like, yeah, we had our good times, but this time, it just, I just always feel like I always have a person in the family member that is something that just sticks out. And I just, not to necessarily say I can't forgive them all, but it's just something that it's just like, we'll never be the same. You know what I mean? Yeah, once you break a bond, it'll never be. Yeah, and I feel yeah, like it, it, never, it, it, never, it never gets to that point. Like, and I feel like there's a lot of people in the family that I just like, there's so many bonds that just can never be repaired the way mm-hmm. I would want it to, I mean, no matter yeah, no matter what. You're, you, you're not supposed to be looking to repair them. You're supposed to be looking to evolve them. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Like, okay, that shit did happen. How can we move on? How can we get If it's really like that, if it's yeah. real love. Yeah, true. I definitely. agree with that. But sometimes I just feel like, like the no response or the the whatever, like the neglectance. I heard you say that. Neglectance, negligence, neglectance, whatever. The, but literally, the no response. I just like it's just it's the biggest disrespect, and that therefore, right there, you already just saying how you feel mm-hmm. without saying it like that. Just it's, it's just going to show like I shouldn't always have to be the the bigger person to step and play that and to fulfill that. Like no, 
especially if I feel a certain way. Like, I'm not always going to be that bigger person. I'm I not. get it. I get it. But to an extent, though, you kind of got to know who you are to certain people. You know? Mm-hmm. Like, yeah. I feel like once you start figuring, like, that, that goes along with figuring out who you are. Once you start figuring out who you are to people, you kind of don't look to them for certain things, you know? Because at that point, you're not even expecting it. If it just comes, it's just an addition to whatever it is that in, got put in place. But after that, you know, it's not really nothing that you you leaning back or you just waiting upon, you know? Yeah. So. Yeah. But my, my most memorable out of the five, I would say that Christmas I was able to get y'all some shit. Yeah, that was a good Christmas when I was able to buy everybody. I honestly, that's why Christmas is my favorite. It's just like, I love when we're just but able the to. the thing, I think the reason why it stuck out the most for that is because I think that was the year. I think I got y'all shit on y'all birthdays, too. It wasn't on y'all birthday because I remember giving you and your uh, you and B uh, gifts late. Mm-hmm. I had to switch our shoes and I had to find this nigga's yeah. shoes. Yeah. So that was the year I got everybody birthday. Because I, mean, I was just thinking about the shit like when we was kids, our family in specific, we wasn't able to, like, the family didn't necessarily show that, that you know, that family trait of, like, loving once another. Like, every everybody was held on this pedestal, so certain families got more than we did. Yeah. So I felt like we was always the one on the back end of the train and type of shit like definitely. they treated us different definitely. so definitely. we was never expecting gifts from from aunties or the most we get is like a birthday card or they say i left your gift at home i remember auntie nikki told me that shit when you were um, like the left your gift the at home was always something what's the i point? never that's one thing i feel like we always got that was i left your gift at yeah, home yeah you left it at home yeah. or something like that or i'm gonna send you this or do it like don't tell don't you tell just, a kid that don't, you, just, you feel me it, yeah yeah, definitely. So I definitely that year, didn't know. I was able to do that, I man. That shit. So good. Yeah. yeah I feel like when you can give stuff, it's just like make it better. Yeah, without without expecting nothing in return. I just did that off the, off the strength of me knowing how we feel amongst one another. You feel me? So, and then the, the fact that I was able to do that and then I wasn't hurting after the fact. You know? Oh, yeah. So, oh, yeah. For real, I want to get y'all mm-hmm. everything y'all Most want, definitely, bro. bro. Most yeah, definitely. Bro. This shit ain't gonna do to get better. You feel me? Damn. Damn. Oh, oh it'll be a couple of for real for real. All oh, the COVID days and this bitch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm trying to tell y'all, bro, yeah. we had a motherfucking the camera year, and car the team, bro. party we had. That oh my god, wish we knew oh, each other that, like that. that, <laughs> that was some fun shit. Oh, I was drinking yeah. Hennessy at that time. When Ooh, niggas with Cedar yeah. Point senior year. Oh, uh, <laughs> you know they not uh, open on the Halloween this year. Ooh. They stopped on the Ooh, night. all type of wow. shit. Yeah. Oh, when niggas came to the motherfucking homecoming, I used to take these niggas to the um tailgates and shit, bro. That shit. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> um, close to it. That's what I'm saying, man. That's and that's why I be wanting everybody to get on their shit because once we able to live and ain't nobody worrying about if they gotta be at work the next day, mm-hmm. how much money in their bank accounts. Once we able to live yeah. comfortably, well, I zone, cannot wait to live. That's like gonna that. be the freedom, best bro. shit. Real I'm, freedom, like I'm trying to tell you, we are gonna be the next family y'all see in the motherfucking tabloids and shit, bro. Cause I niggas not doing it like like we is. I'm sorry, I, I hate to be. Yeah. So you know. No. In your face I'm about really it, but I'm trying to tell you. That shit. Yeah. Every, every, every person that I care about, care about bro, I'm having one that. way or another, bro, they just gonna having that for sure. I agree, yeah. For real. I can't wait till we we get that. I way. feel like that's my mission, bro. Mm-hmm. Oh. Next question is, what do you miss most of your last relationship? Mm. Uh, <laughs> I would say <laughs> no, I already know, I already know. The genuine care for real, for real. Like somebody that acts that actually motherfucking care like how I feel for her. Type shit. Mm. And not just what motherfucking what I'm doing for them this day or a nigga how right, not, right, I right, didn't right, show up right. this day or type shit. Like, you feel me? If I'm not doing something, okay, what's wrong with you? Mm. I would say 
a liability. Mm. Because it's not a lot of people in my life right now that I can rely on to actually, like, you feel me? I can be in 10 buck fuck and be like, call this motherfucker, she mm. coming for like that sure. Net. Like, yeah. it, might, it might be like, damn, you feel me? How you do that? But, nigga, that mm-hmm. motherfucker is no on D way mm-hmm. for mm-hmm. sure. Mm-hmm. Reliability, man. That shit get my whole heart. I ain't gonna cap. Cause once I get it, I'm gonna be that nigga. You feel me? That's how I feel like I am to y'all. When I'm not able to do that shit, that shit crushes my soul. I'm not gonna cap. Mm-hmm. Or do something we need you or something. Yeah, man. Yeah, I do. That shit kills like that. that shit definitely does. Yeah. That's just a fire burning in me though. I'm saying. I am saying, nigga. That's just my big R. <laughs> <laughs> One thing I miss about my last relationship, I never had a serious relationship with someone. Like, oh, yeah, I haven't either. You can't leave. I'm about to say that one's serious, though. <laughs> <laughs> She's gonna try to be the only nigga that makes that decision. <laughs> <thing. laughs> um, we can go that way because I'm still trying to think. Uh, I'll say that friendship because we was friends before anything, so it was like a bond. Not supposed to be, man. Yeah. Aww. So uh, it was just genuine. Friends before relations. Oh my yeah. god, I don't know what that is. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I don't know what I miss about what relationship. Is it nothing or is it nothing you can you can think about off like the top of your head? I feel like it's a little bit of both because <laughs> it's just I like say it's nothing. <laughs> I feel like the niggas I have <laughs> talked to are like crappy, not to not to downplay the good parts, but it's like, bruh, one thing that I miss, I don't think that's just a whole thing, so that's probably what it is. <laughs> okay, let me think what my last, last one was like, that I just, like, just ended, okay, what I miss about that is just the silliness, like, it's just, I wouldn't even say the silliness, I would just say, like, I don't know, y'all, fuck it, skip. He was, a lame. he was a lame at this point. That's what I'm Next. getting from. <laughs> Next question. Um, what do you wish you could spend more time on? Making that motherfucking money and saving that shit. I have the worst saving whatever whatever word of, yeah, the worst saving etiquette now than I did before. I cannot say to save my motherfucking life. <laughs> I can't. If I got it, I'm gone. Here's the visa. I kid you not. Anybody I go out with, I will definitely. Here's my card. I mean, <laughs> Don't even got it for you. Like I'm, that's a, that's I'm a just going to do it. Thing, yeah. You, you, shouldn't do it. Really, you shouldn't really save anyway. You just yeah. put, it, put it towards shit that's going to The dollar don't have no value. You know. Can't take it with you. Can't take it with you. My pops told me, like, um, you saving all that money, somebody gonna spend it when you go. Hell yeah. Either you gonna spend it or they gonna just, spend imagine it. Imagine you just cracked a 50, 50, uh. And you die. Yeah, they gonna have so a, a blast with that shit. Cook, nigga. Now where that money yeah. going? Larry's not your shit. Man. Oh, so I save, I save enough for a rainy day, but I'm not about to go overdo that shit. Yeah. I'm gonna make sure I was good. Balance, man. That's what I be saying. Life is about <laughs> balance. Yeah. yeah. Life is about balance. You but, said, uh, what's something you spend, you can wish you can spend more time on? Yeah. Um, I say just like freely living, bro. Mm. And that, that's kind of like what I was resonating to. Time with myself. If I could get a full year of ameliorating myself, I'd be a cold nigga, boy. Like, nigga, if I'm worry free, bro. I don't care about no type of politics I'm going yeah, on. Yeah, I'm, I'm up somewhere. I'm put up somewhere. Just put up on the island type shit. You feel Give me, me like, a year. A year time, nigga. I will be a cold nigga. I'm trying to tell you. Mm. A 17 year I feel like, for moms, I want to be a better sister. Even though she tell me, like, I'm, like, the best sister ever. I feel like I could do more. I could be better for her. So, I feel like I'm working on that every day. You the oldest? Mm-hmm. Out of me and her. Cause we the only two that got the same mama and daddy, mm. so yeah. And for a minute, I actually kind of left them niggas mm. like good what, year and a half or so. And we we kind of spaced out. We just came back. Like, I just started living with her again in April of this year. See, I could never imagine that, bro. Mm-hmm. Just because how we grew up. But I did it for me though. Yeah. I had to get space. Almost definitely for, me, for sure. Yeah. yeah, you gotta take that time for yourself. I feel like I kind of shut down 
block for one. You gonna oh, implode yeah. if yeah. not, bro. And I don't, I definitely I don't did. be thinking people be hip mm-hmm. to that shit they be putting on you, bro. Like, you put too much stress on a person being themselves. Like, what else do I know how to do? Yep. You feel me? If I'm being yeah. myself and you just telling me, nah, nigga, that's not the way you mm-hmm. being type shit. That's not the way. Like, bro, I'm just being. I just disappeared. <laughs> Hey, you got to. I swear to God, I be want to go yeah. off the map. I want to go off the map right did. now. I'm oh, sorry, yeah. Man. See? And I just know, I just know, like, y'all I have to know where I'm at just mm-hmm. for, like, comfort. But at the mm-hmm. same time, I just be like, bro, I want to get the fuck on. I want to get the fuck That's what it takes sometimes, bro. Like, when you got to leave, you just got to leave, bro. Too. And that's what, I, like, I be doing that shit by any means possible, bro. People be looking at me crazy, but I, whatever method I take to get fucking somewhere that I gotta go, bro, <laughs> nigga, I gotta get that, bro. Too, man, get cause you up, need bro. that, bro. Like, I stay in this motherfucker, I feel like I can't breathe sometimes. Mm-hmm. Like, bro, no, I gotta. But Especially, when I did, she came back, it was like, she holding first, she had a baby and everything. So, yeah. you know, I gotta get to know him a little yeah. bit. It was a whole different thing. I'm like, oh, it's kind of weird a little bit. Oh, yeah, spend some more time on yeah. too. It's like, mm-hmm. with, with the I see them every day all day. Yeah, I, I, I need to get better. more to my youngest, yeah. man. Like, all Because they feel so all fast, bro. Mm-hmm. Grow up so fast. And it be so crazy. Because when we moved out to Riverview, I was like that. I'm like, I'm going to get all, I'm going to get both my nephews. But damn, it was three of them at the time. I'm going to get all my nephews, mm-hmm. get all my little cousins. I'm like, we're going to have a movie night. I'm just putting it off, putting it off. Whole time. Now this nigga is what? 13 years old, I'm like, damn, damn bro. Yeah, no, it'd be yeah, like that time bro, is no hell, just bro. like that. Man. I still remember yeah. my sister when she was like eight, now she 17, about to be 18. Kid, Y'all, yeah. nigga, I remember when I dropped you yeah. off at college, bro. I damn near started to tear up. I'm like, bro, this nigga, <laughs> oh, bro, that shit crazy. That shit yeah. crazy. <laughs> time be flying, nigga, I'm trying to tell you. Yeah. Hey, Dan, just drop my little nigga off to school, bro. That shit crazy. <laughs> that nigga feel like a proud dad, man. <laughs> <Right. laughs> you hear me, yeah, dog? That shit you, crazy, bro. man. Yeah, you gotta, you gotta rekindle that shit, man. Especially if you've been gone for a while. Mm-hmm. Rekindle that shit, and then like you know, amongst your siblings, that's that's probably like the most in yeah. tune you gonna be with yourself, bro. That's how you find find yourself for real. Mm-hmm. I ain't had y'all niggas, bro, siblings. Like, imagine if niggas was the only child. Yeah, I couldn't but I was like, I'm like, how y'all got more than one? It's only literally just me or her. Yeah. It's just me or her. So that'd be like the only child, worse. bro. That should be crazy. <laughs> Especially with a family like us. Mm-hmm. Right, so y'all are connected down there by hip all the time. Yeah. Man. That should be. What was the question? No, we still on the same one. Conversion, man. Mm-hmm. Good like that. All right, next, next question, question is here. Describe the last person. Describe the last person to post in three words. Huh? What the fuck does that mean? Describe the last person to post in three words. What? We're going to skip that one. I'm thinking I'm tripping. Bro. What? Oh. What words can you show? Wait, it's three words. What words can you show? Get together, she read the front what of the class ways she can others show you their appreciation for you? You did that one already, didn't you? Okay, fine. Skip. Um, what adventure would you like to do in the next few months? Next few months. Get on them planes. Yeah, yeah I just want to go on the trip. Get on the plane. Get on, take a break from Michigan. I definitely, yes, absolutely. Uh, you know, I don't care what kind of kind of vacation it is. Steaks in this bitch. Yeah. Liquor. Real, so bro. Steaks. Out the country. <laughs> the liquor. I don't even have to be out the country, out the state, just to get away from this mm-hmm. for once. Like, just to be like, okay, I don't have to worry about no home life. Like, I don't got to do nothing. I'm saying, like, within the next few months, it's just like, I just rather have that vacation. Like, I feel like I deserve that vacation. You feel me? No. Next couple months, I'm trying to help yourself. You gotta think big. I'm man. trying to be on a world tour, nigga. I'm trying to tell you, bro. Think big. This this motherfucking world is too think big to think small. Like, <laughs> 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 hey, that's some powerful ass quote no, right for there. Real. You think know, big. honestly, couple months, right? Because I definitely, we can do in a couple I definitely months, wanna. Either. I don't want to stay yeah, in Chicago, but, um, but I would definitely love a vacation. I feel like I don't go on vacations enough. Like, especially, bro, I'm trying to do tell y'all, like, we should, you, you, you we should be taking a vacation. Up, quick years fly past, bro. Yeah. Like, the months be like that. Like, literally, there's 12 of them bitches in a year. 
Virginia we halfway vacation. through the year already, bro. Vacationing is what I More than half, as a matter of fact. I don't remember when it was just January. Swear to God. Like, and it's New supposed Year's, to be a whole New Year's year. Just hit, bro. Like, isn't that fucking crazy? Crazy. Time flying, yeah. man. But don't let time get you on that, that mentality. Neither time is true. all in here. Yeah. Put a limit imagine on if we didn't have a calendar. Measure. Yeah, imagine we had no calendar. Niggas wouldn't be giving a fuck yeah, about what day it is. That's what put the pressure on you, bro. Man. It would not give a fuck about what time it is, what day of the week it is, or none of that shit. What month? Don't worry about time, bro. It's just do you. This shit is a marathon. Speed bumps, not brick walls. Yes, indeed. Um, what traditions would you like to start this year? Traditions? Yeah. Talks like this off camera. Off camera, bro. Like amongst each other. That's why I be saying it's, it's too much. It's too much. Niggas gotta find out. Mm. Like, we shouldn't have to find out as much shit as we do about each other if we love one another like this, bro. We should be able to sit down and talk to each other, break bread, laugh, love, and converse with another, bro. That shit should be should be too short, bro, to fall out about some goofy shit. And now we just sitting amongst each other, animosity and all of that shit, resentment. I don't fuck with that. A new tradition I would like to start. Working, working together, working more closely together. You feel me? That's what. I was just sipping on the drink. Mm-hmm. Working more closely together, so everybody working toward a common cause. When you sit down at the table, it's, it's strength in numbers, you feel bro. Me? It's strength in numbers. For real. Yeah. Niggas don't no, be thinking I about that. Real. Niggas do not be thinking about that. That's why I be saying, imagine you piece, heads bro, it's too many thing, of us. Bro. It's too many of us. Everybody should have their hand in a different cookie jar. We bring that in unison. Oh, my God. I have a tradition I want to start this year. I don't know. I feel like, I don't know, y'all. <laughs> I don't know. I'm not really good at this. I think it's not prepping herself. <laughs> That's so mine. Another, another like, tradition? I feel I don't like. Think it's nothing. I feel like. I love my holidays. I love sitting on with y'all. No, one tradition is not being at the fucking house every fucking holiday. <laughs> it pisses me off that it's just like every. And then another thing is another tradition I want to start is not eating the same food for every holiday too. We eat the same fucking food. If I can have a seafood boy on the fourth of July, bitch, I'll be crazy. <laughs> Shrimp, eggs, motherfucking potatoes, crab legs, shrimp boil. We're gonna go get a seafood <laughs> boil. We're gonna go do a seafood boil. That's right. next next time. Yeah. Next next a time. Next time we That's gonna do a mukbang on this motherfucker. Yeah, I promise you. Like, yeah, yeah, you know, right? Look, no, they be having the table filled up in that bitch. <laughs> Just imagine everybody going in on a meal. Niggas not gonna that be talking about shit. Like damn, this time. motherfucker. Yeah, that's the thing. Everybody oh, gonna want to be eating. Y'all gonna want to know what we eating, what we rated. It's that one. What's that one nigga? Keep Keep some, see, <laughs> that nigga be on there. This is what I got from such and such. <laughs> Straight face and everything. Yeah, we gonna get on that, bro. Get free. I rate this a seven point five. Seven point five. I'm telling you, that's another crazy little. You know, I've always been obsessed with mukbangs. Be love. Uh, Nick and Cabo Avocado, I've been obsessed with him. Bro, that's, is that that one nigga that's big as hell? No? Yes, he's yes. crying and shit. Yeah. <laughs> yes. I don't know who that like was. Like being bro. in different spots for the um, holidays. holidays. Yeah. I feel like we should have like a jar, have like plenty different little destinations wrote down on a piece of paper. Mm. Or mm-hmm. just doing mm-hmm. new things on yeah. the holiday, you know what I mean? Because you know, like Christmas and stuff, my, me, mom, and my sister, we every day, I mean, every year for Christmas, we would be at like the movies. Mm-hmm. Nobody would be at the movies. Yep. Mm. Wow, that's mm-hmm. different. Yeah, she said it right. It's just opening gifts. Mm-hmm. Yeah, we'll go to I didn't even know that should be open. Yeah, it, it if it was a movie coming out, then it, people would be there. But other than that, we just go see a random movie. Mm. So that's great. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Family time. I like yeah, that. I like that. Me. I like that. Gotta cherish that shit. Yeah. So I just say for my more family stuff because my family don't really come together that much. For yeah. really, literally anything. Niggas used to look at our family and adore this shit. Yeah. I'd be like, bro, that's man. That's so crazy. Yeah, I agree. I ain't like this. Mm-hmm. All the time, niggas been playing it crazy. All the time, family ain't even family. Family ain't what you think it is. Yeah. Blood don't make you family. Not mm-hmm. make you family. Mm-hmm. So y'all, y'all treat me better than mom. <laughs> y'all pick me up off the streets. <laughs> 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 you know, sometimes. Not about who you are, it's what you do. Yeah. 
No, I appreciate your life. You know that you came in. I thank you everybody that's so at you. I appreciate it. Thank you, the little brother they probably looking for. <laughs> 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 I think that's really what it is. <laughs> I'm dead. That was funny. <laughs> it's okay. No, that's funny as hell. Like, <laughs> I'm giving y'all the side eye. <laughs> I'm just fucking around. Um, what's our next question? Damn, we should have been smoking on this one for real. That was I mean, okay. I can always go get the ganja. No, no problem. Right. Every time you say that. <laughs> Last time. <laughs> would y'all like me to go get the ganja? Bro, when we went to Delmar, why would I come back and damn near finish church shit by myself? Why was she in this with Sean? That's what made me drive to motherfucking Coney Town. I this motherfucker, it. I told her, I'm like, go mm-hmm. get go get my glass. I don't think she's gonna come back for her shit. She really came back with my mom. <laughs> I was like, oh yeah. This bitch knew she couldn't draw. Who has been inspiring you lately? I wanna say lately, but probably my favorite rapper, Missy Elsa, rest in peace, but mm-hmm. just everything he does just inspired me, motivated me a lot authentic How about you? Who's about his business? Real, real guy. I definitely looked up something. Sure. Be My like that, man. No cap. Be like that, man. See, that's why I be saying, like, certain things people be thinking they doing it just for niggas being mm-hmm. like, like running with the wave or whatnot. But like, no, that was like my real some of that shit, man. I'm trying to tell yeah, you, bro. Like when I met that world nigga, world. heard, bro. That shit was like a two second little thing, but I'm talking about. But it's everything. It is everything. Yeah, I wish I could have been. Real, you see a person, man. man. I'm trying to tell you, that ain't gonna be the last time, bro. We about to be locked in. I swear, to God. it's the last <laughs> thing that's, I that's did. That's all I, I be thinking about, like, bro. We about to be on the same level. Oh, so we dream team shit. You mm-hmm. That's how I feel with Kyrie, bro. I'm trying Kyrie. Kyrie. Yeah, that nigga. Yeah, I'm and trying I, to tell you all the cool motherfucking uh, Kyrie what's names, for sure. I gotta meet. I gotta meet Michael Jordan, and I gotta meet Derrick Rose for sure. I definitely gotta meet. You already know yeah. It's a couple yeah. cool yeah. niggas for real, bro. That I be, I be inspiring me lately. Who's been inspiring me lately? Like, ain't nobody like that real shit. Not everybody want to be the table, but back then it was. Who's been inspiring me lately? You want to know something? <laughs> lately, I have been looking at MCS, so, but that's not what I'm going to say. Um, but I have been listening to him. I'm actually going to go. I say, I say I people around you. me, too. Yeah. Just all seeing how they how they actually trying to get serious with their stuff, how they moving forward, whatever they trying to do, working hard. I, like circle. yeah, seeing hard yeah. work, bro. That shit, mm-hmm. that shit inspires me, bro, and I love it. Most I really definitely. love to see it. Most definitely, yeah. People, Good people time. putting it into themselves for sure. Yeah. But lately, I would have to say it's kind of weird to say this, but Instagram, bro, seeing my algorithms, cause on TikTok my shit is flooded with with. The shit of the world, that mm-hmm. shit ain't nothing but man, the world crazy, bro. The yeah. world is crazy. I can take niggas down. We should do one of them episodes too. A I'm trying to, bro. That shit. I'm really trying to because that's I can probably really, gonna be the I'm next one. I can really get into that shit. That's probably gonna be the next like, one. We can really get into that. And they ain't even I'll gotta be no no writing down no topic shit. Me and B was just in this bitch trying to shit with that shit. That shit crazy. Watch my drink. Watch my drink. That's when Ari will just be sitting back. And just Are you not going to listen? Oh, I had Ari sitting there listening to me for an hour. And that's when I would get you out of this country. Our room was at night. Yeah, I'm just sitting there. Between her and Deja, I'm like, what the fuck? They were sitting there listening to me for us for a whole damn near two hours. Shit is not a fire drill, nigga. I swear to God. But Instagram, my algorithm ain't nothing but like luxurious houses, motherfucking whips that you dream of you feel me i'm talking mm-hmm. about like i need that i need every part of that bro oh yeah and <laughs> i close to that. myself been so I don't like so nigga can't nobody stop me like who who said i but can't you, be bro. successful but you who said i can't have this shit? Only person that stop who said i can't have this shit, bro or if somebody say you can't why can't I? man why can't that was always my thing nigga. why can't I? and i'm gonna put it in your face I'm gonna put it in your face. Just the motherfuckers well, who think can't. I can't have it, bro. Like you think you think you this person? No, nah, nigga, I'm me. I know. I I'm know me, I am. Nigga. Nigga, what are you talking about? Man. I don't think I'm that nigga. I'm me. Boy. Man, who you telling? Who you telling? Oh, yeah, for sure. For um, sure, man. I need all parts of that. I need to know what it what it feels like to walk in a motherfucking, a motherfucking car lot and be like, yeah, give me that. No, nah, for real. Give me, give, me, give me that, too. Definitely. You feel me? Drop, yeah, man, drop that off at the crib, bro. Give me that. 
walking the motherfucking mall knowing I got that sack on me. Like, nigga, uh, let me get that and, uh, yeah, let me get this. Feel me? You got yeah. this colorway with these? Man, Not worrying about shit. Y'all, y'all clear your schedule for the weekend. We about to take the yacht out. Man, my nigga said, <laughs> my nigga V said they do this shit for the weekend, man. Man, y'all yeah. was like, damn, what? Yeah, I mean, like, they do this shit That's for the weekend. That's why I cannot wait to have money and I'm so comfortable because it's just like my house. I don't know cars that well, but the cars that I want, but my house is just going to be like. Right. Uh, I'm going to do my own crib. Right. I hope. Facts. I, and this I is one, to, one, yeah. one, um goal or like dream that I just have no matter um, like I don't want to have kids for real, even if I just have one but I would just love for all the kids to just come to my house for Christmas if not every year at least once a year just stay the night with me and they can all go out of town I don't care what they do they can have their anniversary weekend but I just want all the kids to stay with me and have Christmas at my glamorous beautiful luxurious house <laughs> so yeah <laughs> I'll be the one yeah. taking care of the kids. Oh, man, see. Oh, that, oh, that Batman shit. Oh, Batman. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Batman, what do y'all mean by that? Nigga, I'm talking about a superhero lifestyle, my mm-hmm. nigga. Where he was living. <laughs> yeah. Exactly. Okay, this is like yeah, so. Yeah. K had a bat cave yeah. for real. Nigga. This is so off topic, but I would love to have, um, like, a UK accent. Bro, like, <laughs> that's so true. My mind is like bro. somewhere completely different. You can't learn that shit, bro. That's why. Why, why, why do you think? Language, mama, mama was saying this other day. She like, why are you talking like Peppa Pig? It's like because I've been watching Love, Love Island UK. And she's like, it's just been. It's just the yeah, way sir, 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 it's sir, shit. Like, man, like if you throw, if you throw right. that motherfucker, like nigga, if you just go up and go to UK. That shit started just coming off. For sure. Give me eight. Then you start picking up on it, bro. Jesus. I'll be. I have the best accent. Everybody be doing that little basic shit. Yeah. Same shit. Yeah. Same shit. shit down for real. Niggas gonna be like, damn, what? Like, fuck around, like, go um, forget your native <laughs> um, tongue. You feel me? Oh, um, tongue. It's a bit raw, ain't it? Too. <laughs> nah, for real. I really do that. Um, let's skip over the fashion crazy. Yeah. Um, tell us a memory or a secret. A memory a or a secret? Or yes. Preferably, I would like to hear you guys' secrets. <laughs> <laughs> if you don't mind telling me. I would love to hear a secret from you guys. I would be maybe your deepest, darkest, or <laughs> just. We ain't just telling you, man. Nigga, what the fuck? Okay, no, tell me. Okay, shit. tell me your like. I don't want to hear secrets. I don't think I keep nothing from y'all. That is that'll make yeah, y'all niggas hard. Like, you know, like, like, just yeah. blow your mind type shit. I don't think. Uh, Brian, you kind of give me. You want to tell me your secret? I'm trying to think of a secret. More than a shit. memory. Um. That niggas don't already know. Like what the fuck? That's what I'm saying. Like, All right, shit give us a memory you know. then, guys. Ooh, I'll go to one of my favorite memories. Not that I appreciate it more than anything, because to be gone, my friend you probably be watching all them rated R movies when I was little. And I ain't supposed to be watching that shit. <laughs> but just sitting there, Everybody's just like spending that time shit. with him, it just, like, <coughs> him just being here and just being around him, I appreciate that shit more than something that I tell Dylan all the time. I always be telling him, I'm like, if your granddad was still alive, I feel like that would be the one person that will just cherish you being you the most out of mm-hmm. anybody and I never making you so feel like you're an outcast ever because I definitely be feeling like an outcast but just having that strong male role model in my life in general I just yeah. miss and yeah. I just cherish it more definitely. I feel like as a kid you just don't because you just don't be thinking about it but yeah, I understand like, it yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. my favorite memory Honestly, I could just say, like, I don't know, growing up with y'all. Just to see, because it's just like, bro, it's nothing like having a sibling. I was saying this. It's nothing. Yes, like just certain shit. Yeah, grocery store runs. Even when Mm. we, bro, let me tell you how exciting this was. 
Mama had bought a fucking minivan, y'all, and they had TVs <laughs> in there. Do you <laughs> not know hey, how geek it was? Straight from the so lot, nigga. fucking oh geek. We didn't even give a fuck that it was a minivan. Now people were getting minivans. We that just geeked that we had the TVs in there. <laughs> what? Niggas was on CDs so and hard. The, we used to watch a movie every door. door. Bitch, it don't matter if it was five minutes away. We were watching the movie. The automatic sliding door, nigga. All we got to do is boom. That bitch is Yeah. Niggas <laughs> had that. Headphones and all oh, that was crazy. <laughs> right. I was like, yes, oh my god, this is <laughs> lit. So tactical, yeah, nigga. That was shit. definitely. I thought we was the sweetest niggas out. <laughs> it was nigga watching TV. See, look, look, that's how I got. That's how I started fucking with Django, bro. Uh, oh when I watched watch that shit that week. <laughs> Every time we got in the car, watching Django. Django is that? Hey, Jamie Foxx. That's a cold nigga, bro. Yeah, that's a cold nigga. Man. Do you still want to? Oh yeah. Damn, yeah, because I don't like drinking and smoking at the same time. I like to be more drunk than drunk. So go. You know, I think we should all take a group shot for Gianni's birthday. Thanks. <laughs> you know, I don't want to get sued for showing this label, so I'm just going to turn okay. turn the bottom around. I mean, the bottom. They just, yeah. Man. We're not paying you. Are you paying us first? Yeah. yeah. Tyus, you want to sponsor us, and you know what your bottle looking oh, like. Tyus, so, oh, now I got another one. Oh, we don't want to <laughs> turn that bitch around. Like I said, you ain't, you ain't get her. shit for me. But if you would love to sponsor me, I would definitely sip on all. Oh, you're the more call? Your Limion. Limion. All them affiliates. Yeah, Once y'all start seeing this, we need that bag in too. We'll and then together. when I become the world's shortest model. <laughs> we can eat together. Well, we ain't here on. I guess I'll take the... Oh, yeah, we'll definitely... We'll definitely be one of those motherfuckers walking in New York Fashion Week with the full E on. I <laughs> promise you that. I don't give a fuck if it. To my fully kitted nigga. Literally. Like that Kanye with right. fucking yeah. Easy. It's <laughs> gonna be really us with the full <laughs> <laughs> E. No play. The, uh, no play. No play. Oh, Niggas gonna want that. Just like that spider shit, they gonna want that. To my 500 nigga. And pre drop, pre sale, you getting, you get all that. Bro, I remember this nigga Drake sold out in like 20 minutes, bro. Hell yeah, you I'm could saying. never, you couldn't touch your shit. Man, that's that, that bitch Kylie sold out in one minute. Better enjoy it while it's long. Yeah, we getting that. Better get it while it gets good. Cause nigga, we get that bullshit, nigga. Don't lie. I'm trying to tell y'all, y'all think we bullshitting, bro. We're gonna be the youngest nigga. That was hot. That bitch trying to sweep, bro. Yeah, that was hot. That was in Vegas. That was hot. That was hot. Are you gonna drink with that water? <laughs> Don't yeah, show the label. Yeah, uh, ooh, fuck. <laughs> I need that. <laughs> um, y'all, hold on. Sorry, I forgot the question. It's on mine. How long? Yeah. We already damn near. Two, we at two hours. Yeah. Two years, six minutes. Two hours, six minutes. Um, hold on. Now let me find it then. Let me find two good questions, y'all. You know, talk amongst yourselves. Don't just sit in silence. Sit up real quick, man. <laughs> Boy, why you don't be on the freestyle, y'all? All right. <laughs> Listen. <laughs> one, let me tell y'all one iconic time that we had as a trio before we lost one of our members. Yeah. We had the littest motherfucking freestyle session. That was so hard. We was so fucked that up. Was so hard. And if you know me, you know I do not freestyle. Man. With me, Daylene, you know, so we got third compadre. Was in the kitchen just freestyling, just going. <laughs> no, I from three to five in the morning, we got no freestyling. The sun was up. And that bitch like, so who we going for breakfast? Man, the sun up. Niggas come out there to go get Coney again. Man, we, we was so fucked up. Be, and not, a, but you can't. I don't know what the fuck I was drinking and smoking. <laughs> and we was in your but basement. And in that's the basement. what was crazy. That's gonna be next guest for yeah. sure. I need that, Murray getting out here. That's what's crazy. Cray. Y'all gonna see Baby Joker on this bitch. <laughs> yeah. Mm. You uh, feel me? That's my crash out nigga right there. Uh oh, I'm sorry. Y'all supposed to be looking for the question. Let's put let's put the ganja down. Let somebody <laughs> go pick it up. Uh, pick it up at your own risk. Okay, let's do this one. Name five things you're grateful for. Mm. I would love to hear what y'all have to say about.
Damn. Nature. Mm. And I have to say, uh, like wisdom. Mm -hmm. Um, somebody else can go. I'm just trying to find another person. Um, I would say I'm grateful for being here, I'm like great. present. Grateful for being healthy. Mm -hmm. um, grateful that for the lessons. That health is crazy. Yeah. That health is no, crazy. No cap. No cap. You know how many niggas get born with disabilities, bro? Or in the hospital that right now, living crazy. like this. Like, could you imagine so? living like as an amputee, bro? Yeah. Mm -hmm. That shit is beautiful. That Having shit. sight. You know how many niggas can see? That shit to, That's crazy. crazy. Yeah. You know, yeah. I, I used to do this all the time. Crazy. I used to try to pick up stuff like I didn't have another arm. Crazy. Or something just to see. You got to, bro, you got to go into the whole part like, of the yeah. brain for that. You know how strong them niggas is? People, people like that, I feel so bad for them because it's just like, bro, you just... Niggas call that shit was just taking... Mm -hmm. I just seen a motherfucker drop from her feet. Yeah. Man. I'm like, what Man, the fuck? Man, nigga like, in the yeah. hospital, that nigga was literally on his motherfucking arm. Doing it, running, running in that bitch. <laughs> <laughs> and they chasing this nigga. I'm still yeah. sitting there like, I'm, 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 like, I'm, I'm in that they bitch like, what the, the fuck? This nigga's using his arm to run and, and, and then be the, be the employee ass right after that. Kid you not. Strong as hell. Beating his ass. That's nothing but so hard work. Like, All his life, nigga. What? Hey, that I do not want to see one of them niggas in no Man, no cap. He made his nose oh, I'm like, what the fuck? Yeah, they think a nigga's playing. Mm -hmm. He was not. I'm like, damn. Think a nigga's playing. I feel so bad for you, but shut the fuck up. I don't want to mm. fuck with it. I said that. Good. Um, <laughs> five things I'm grateful for. Shit. I would definitely say family. Um, <laughs> this is sad that I don't know what else. Um... Man, niggas saying them is career for real. No, I was, that wasn't even on my mind at all. I would definitely say health because I feel like when mom would be telling me how sick I was as a kid, it just made me feel like, like thank you. I used to get your ass sick. Um, let me think, what else? Um, life itself, just like how we live in. I mean, it, it may not be like 110% the best, but shit. We we yeah, make an account for it. Like yeah, we make it, we make sure. it a fire. We, we do what we do what we can. It's the um, last thing I do, we get there, nigga. Oh, um, let me think what else am I grateful for? I'm thankful for healthcare workers. <laughs> hey, no, that's for real. Nobody wants to do that shit. Nobody wants to do that. Nobody wants to do that. And then they was putting their motherfucking lives yeah. on the line. Mm -hmm. That's what they said. everything. They that crazy. shit. Niggas was dropping like some flies. Goals with that. And another thing I want, another one I'm grateful for is teachers. Yeah. I know my answers are probably like shitty, but no, teachers, I'm so right. grateful about that. It's it's so it's no yeah. mentality behind it's that. If so you want to great, you feel me? I you want to have so much shit in kids patience. for sure. And lead the nation have, type shit. Yeah, that that is, kind of teacher for sure. Yeah. The patients y'all have. Making doctors and the all that shit. Yeah. No kind of yeah. teachers, for sure. But the yeah. shit that they be trying to push, hell no. No. I ain't fucking Certain with Certain things, no, I, I agree with that. But definitely, I, I would say those are the people I feel like. That's why mm. I, I feel like teachers should get paid way good. more. That was good. Way yeah. more than what they do. I feel like yeah. teachers, yeah. they get, they get so much. Shit, especially now, nigga. Man, what? it was a they girl. Put they, they put their hands on, TikTok, on, she on she teachers like it's yeah. normal. It's normal. Yeah. She threw a shoe at the teacher that was in the bitch. Just like, I don't know what the me. fuck. The it patience you gotta me, have. You to gotta have to do that because man. Patience out the ass, bro. That, that you are not, and you in high school, yeah, a grown nigga like me? Yeah, bro. Damn, they're probably bigger than you. No, they, that's they, not going. Yeah. That's yeah. not going. I think that is literally probably. Yeah. I could take that from like a little joint. You feel me? You might act up at home like this. Let me calm a little bro down. Yeah, the patience is, grown, is, is crazy. Uh -uh. And then the dedication. The dedication just to teaching. Teaching kids. Yeah, And then having to go virtual. And learn how to do that shit. Yeah. You still yeah. doing it? Yeah, you. Crazy. You know. The right. intention yeah. behind it for sure. You know. Mm -hmm. you definitely got a passion for kids. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. No, 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 Yeah. <laughs> 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 Don't say y'all. That is so corny. <laughs> <laughs> uh, Be one of the five things you're grateful for.
Ain't on love. Mm-hmm. Ain't on that love. Like, bro. Feel that difference. You feel me? Like, feel that way different. Yeah, from that. I think we're, 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 we're it's just motherfucking here. This bitch crazy. Feeling like experience and experience. The, the world shit. crazy, bro. Like, we got some shit we don't even know about. I need yeah. to know what that's like, bro. Like, what's that? For sure. You know, I say. You know, one thing that I am interested in in y'all little um, weird, uh, I don't know. <laughs> I call that shit weird. weird. <laughs> the, um. Like the shape shifting and all that shit, whatever you call it. I I seen the video. Remember that video mm. I showed you when that that little whatever that looking thing turned into like a donkey. I'm like, what the fuck is <laughs> going on? And you know, I believe in that. And now another damn. What was the other thing? Dracula. Hell no. I wish I could be a vampire. Though. I would do that. I think vampire over werewolf. That shit hurt. Yeah. <laughs> that shit. That shit hurt. Oh, let me bro. think. I can't think of that for y'all. He I got all kids in that bitch. I'm like, oh, <laughs> the little, the little thing where they be sending people, like where people go missing, you can never find them. I believe that too. Abducting them. The government has them and shit. Like right. the kids are yeah. They put yeah. them on commercials. Yeah, I believe that. The kids see on the commercials. I definitely believe in that too. I just take it to that to island. To that that shit. Yeah, yeah. Up. yeah. I'm scared to. I'm scared to look up. it up because I feel like the government is gonna come fuck me over in the end. So I don't never look that shit up. Oh, but I definitely. Hell yeah! I don't want to. I don't want to be taken. That shit. You know about the, the family that, that whole world, like the family, the Rockefeller. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. The Illuminati. I used to believe it. I ain't believed in that shit since I was a kid. That shit is definitely real. Doja Cat. That bitch is a. Fucking demon. demon. I still demon. fuck with those cameras still. Devil time. came and took her whole Nigga, shit. Yeah, yeah, yeah. That, that fucking she, She's, she's eight. Like, I don't like believe there's no turn around. That shit scared the fuck out of me. She is totally she's she's good. Good. She's one of them with a the price. The that crazy bitch used to be is, on live um, for COVID. Then that bitch went for demonic demon. Yeah. Black eyes thing. and shit. Have y'all ever oh, seen her before she got like that? Did y'all see her before she got like that? Yeah, that's what I mean. She was from St. Joe's Street. Yeah, that bitch just went. I see the boy, transition. No eyebrows. I seen that. I'm like, yeah, she she's went, done. Uh, Britney Spears. Yes. That bitch eating her that alive. She's Britney shaving Spears. her off. No, <laughs> Britney Spears. Yeah, she dropped some weight too. Bro, what? Yeah, Britney Spears. I don't know. She give me. She need motherfucking help. She's screaming for attention with them motherfucking dancers. <laughs> but that should be funny. And that's really the thing. He, it's not a joke. She probably really do need some motherfucking help. Because when that bitch was born, it was the, 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 the world was like, what the world was like? Yeah, because she was one of the first people that was that shit on the internet. Oh, you want to, bro, you can't even go to sleep. That shit you, you see on TV. That's yeah, why I want to know the shit with Kanye. Because it's like, yeah. that shit is every oh, night. Oh, I don't want that to happen to me. I was that so shit scared. is every yeah. night for me. You know, you know how they was like, how that shit with Kanye was? Kanye. I'm talking about Kanye. But <laughs> <laughs> Kanye, they was saying oh, when that nigga was locked up and shit, he just disappeared. I'm like, He's that's gone. some scary yeah. shit. Yeah, Kanye. Kanye they yeah, fucked that nigga know. Kanye you up. See that nigga the going? tweets, the nigga tweets he was saying, hell yeah. Oh, yeah. Go. You know that nigga cannot get on no social media platform uh, after the Jewish shit. That nigga Kanye, when they was saying like they was locking him up in psychiatric hospitals, they was fucking that nigga up for real. For real. real. That nigga definitely, they definitely fuck Kanye up. I feel so bad for Kanye. Because that, that, that nigga's yeah. a genius. Be the He's a that genius. Be. But they got him, man. Yeah, and you too. see why you see why Beyonce and Jay-Z don't say motherfucking shit. But that bitch the queen of the demons. Oh yeah. Not that bitch been a demon since I was a little kid. <laughs> I love that bitch. You know what's so that don't know this, bro? Sasha yeah. Fierce, y'all, yeah. that's her yeah. demon. That's her demon person. That's why I'm like, bro, y'all going to the that's concerts? Her demon. She snatching all y'all shows. That shit did look fun, but I'm like, hell, that Rihanna bitch scary. Rihanna at the Super Bowl? That bitch, it's a video yeah. out there. Like, why snatching they show so this? many songs. Like, yeah. Yeah. Bro. Cardi, yeah. oh, nigga, what? Uzi? I don't know. Uzi? 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 Yeah. Uzi? Yeah. Demonic. Hey, Leslie? Hey, why everybody get up like Uzi? Why you call that nigga Leslie? Leslie? Nigga said Leslie. And that nigga be talking to JT like. I'm talking about like the horns on his shit. Yeah. Uzi, yeah, Uzi is not even going to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And the monitor go, hell yeah, that was just like accepting that shit. A fucking weirdo. But yeah. Cardi and them don't show that they I feel they, like they, they ain't soft over mis- enough. They probably yet. just misunderstood. Sometimes they don't Playboy get in that shit. They be oh, Playboy Cardi. Okay, that right. nigga's a dinosaur, bro. Y'all seen this nigga face? No. His cheeks is so fucking chiseled. Who are we talking about? Playboy Cardi. I don't know what he look like. Bro, this nigga Not looks right like Dracula. No cap. 
Okay. Some say. drugs do be eating them away. And you know I'm what they get in the lie. industry? The labels and shit will provide that shit to them. Like hell they yeah, they get them everything. Them. They yeah. give you everything you need. You want to blow up tomorrow, yeah. bitch? You oh you blowing up? Yeah. No matter what, however you how you want to go, they got this the price. Studio, yeah. shit. This the price you want to go down. You want to meet this person? You want to go to this party and be butt ass naked and see other yeah, act the fuck that weird, that shit. I believe that shit too. All them weird demonic ass parties. That rock nation party. Yeah. I know that bitch is old. Oh, yeah, oh, 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 the all white party, party. Oh, the all white party. Yeah, that when I see them pictures, I'm like, oh yeah. Them them like, really really them 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 like, them basketball players being in shit. Oh, oh, all that shit. This like, nigga like, Shaq. Yeah. Hey Shaq. Oh my goodness. Hey that nigga. That's a funny nigga. Shaq is funny no. as fuck. I'm not gonna lie. Oh, uh, Dennis Rodman. He was he like the first. Shaq give me the vibe. He did some funny shit. Bro. Wait, what? Shaq is so much. Hey Shaq, bro. You cook, bro. He did that to K Hart. Y'all ain't never seen that. K Hart did. What's your heart? Bro, I think this nigga shot like a police officer or something. Yes, this nigga's a police officer. He, he, he him and K Hard up there threw him on the car and started humping a nigga. Say this they gonna do to you in prison. That Shaq <laughs> is a big nigga. I ain't gonna lie. I'll be so scared that's that nigga. a big nigga. Bro, you that selling out for crazy. a bag like bro. that, bro. You doing this on national you TV. This motherfucking, yeah. Bro, y'all on this bitch look like a a Rottweiler Chihuahua and this shit. <laughs> <laughs> like, what the, the fuck? Rock, you get the fuck out? Like, bro, you doing that for some cheese, bro? K R G you this going there for cheese, bro? Like, that shit crazy. Exactly. That shit crazy. Bro. Nigga, if you telling me I don't care her, you think I'm about to do this scene, nigga? So do y'all think Will Smith and Jada Pickett is in there? What? Will Smith, th- nigga, how you think this nigga stay relevant? That, that nigga scene he pulled at the Grammys? That nigga said. Slap the fuck up a nigga <laughs> on TV. What? A Keep script? your name. You had that shit. You had that shit. Keep my name at your fucking life. I said, oh, I did with the finger and it just did not come out right, guys. Oh my god, it's the drugs. The craziest part, you gotta look at actors different after that. Like, damn, nigga. So, do y'all think y'all have a price? Fuck no. Once you start fucking with my free will, that's where we gotta go. Fuck well, yeah. no, nigga. That's where we gotta go. Cause exactly. free will is everything. Oh, you gotta think about what them niggas endure on a day to day. These niggas telling them what songs to put out. That shit just gets so deep into them. What the test on their body, time. how they that's dress, great. what they compose. So do y'all think like Megan Fox and them is in there? Do you think she has some different shit? Cause she drink blood and shit. She yeah. into that. That give me like that give me like cult vibes. Yeah, like regular cult Rock vibes. Cults. Ever since I seen American Horror Story, y'all can watch Coke. Y'all can watch that they shit. They telling you. That horror, shit, like, when I seen that shit, that shit fucked with my head so hard. Bro, the movie, the show, the shit, this, that shit was American Horror Story, I'm telling y'all, get into that shit. American Horror Story. They say, like, some shit pop up, like, on a movie. This shit's a new shit. It was already out, like, 10 years before. Hell yeah, the shit. Telling me this nigga is this nigga. Or shit. He's not making a movie. He's not making a movie. He's not making a movie. I think somebody read the Bible. I'm not drawing no shit up like that, bro. Like, it's like, that's what I'm saying. I know you cooked up that Stranger Things. That's tr- yeah. That shit gets so I good. Know. Stranger yeah. Things is so fucking good, but I don't. I I just can't. I just can't. I just can't. I just can't come to picture where where where's. I need to go where they think this is happening. I need a real life, real life you situation. You don't think that in no backwoods shit. No, exactly. but that's shit. a we good motherfucking about. series, bro. You, you know, you know about that's a good ass series. Just parts of the world that you ain't never even heard of. That's why I would love to go see another planet. You know, we love to find another You know, we like want to like more trillions or some shit like that. Planets? Galaxies. Oh. Um, I don't know. Made of like a bazillion planets. Yeah, we're small as shit. I do we know. We not love them. I got a video on my phone to find it. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, yeah, yeah, but that I'm kind not. of stuff I would definitely mm-hmm. uh, chime in with. But anything else? Absolutely not. Like you just went deep on that one. That's yeah. type shit. Cause shit. y'all wouldn't expect that from me. I don't know. Expect the unexpected. Y'all gotta get up. All the movies up on that. Yeah, it's a whole lot of shit. But I do love them celebrities. Oh, it's celebrities that I really. They don't want that AI shit. shit. All this bullshit that's coming out. Hey, they motherfucking smoking a motherfucking time through this bitch. They smoking niggas out, bro. So y'all really been like robots? The wildfires and shit. What? You didn't see that Hawaii. shit? What football game was that? 
Oh, you talking about with the black man? He mm-hmm. had like the shit. Y'all see the trailer for the movie? Yeah. The yeah. creator? I'm yeah. getting yeah. Robots about to take over the world? Yeah. No, um, that's one thing I don't. They I do think, right I don't face, think bro. technology is going to take over absolutely 110%. No, they like, know. The robots are definitely big. Look, no, but the robots they make it be like coding their own language and shit. They be having to shut the motherfuckers down because they be. Yeah, like they Because yeah. they're too smart for me. Uh huh. <laughs> Yeah, I definitely I would know. love to know what's going like, on. What, in the what world. would you need all of that for? Niggas was made to drive their own car. I don't want this bitch know. driving me. Man, yeah, no, no for real. real. I would, I would, I would love to get in the lab, though. Man, that's the reason why I paid for this bitch. Or like us. I feel like it did. The government did, or anybody that made clones of us. You know, one thing I feel like we are not living in the real world. Like this, none of this okay. is real. That's I feel like we've already been here before, and we're just living it differently. But we the don't know our past life. And, and I would love to yeah, know yeah, what my past life was. You know, like what I. Y'all believe in reincarnation? Mm-hmm. reincarnation. What? Reincarnation. I, I don't think, think every time I want to come back. But I feel like we just souls. I don't really. I feel like this is an experience. I don't really think. We're just, we're just people in another body. Life. Yeah, I think. I think that too. Because our bodies got to die, but yeah. it's... Because look, see? Yeah, yeah. But look, no, like when, if they was to clone humans, it's always going to lack that essence that humans got. That's why I That's why like that movie show, that Disney yeah. shit, y'all see that? Yeah. I, I see, see that. That bitch made in the car. I'm like, damn, that That's bitch crazy. Like, we, we just bodies. Man. It's an experience. We just jump on this bitch. A three body. Body. Yeah, that means y'all can watch um, Inside Out. Mm-hmm. It's just the emotions part of it. Mm-hmm. The emotions. They're like trying to teach like good, good life. Yeah. They don't give y'all yeah, some yeah, shit yeah. right now. I'm not gonna lie. Yeah, they always use real shit and kids. Backyard mm-hmm. talk after niggas they ain't linked up in a while. You feel me? Yeah. All right. This is our final last question, guys. Mm-hmm. What are some of your insecurities? Mm-hmm. Tap it in. What you gonna say? You can name as many as you want. I don't like when a female is taller than me. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so dead. I'm a short person. Yeah, I don't have yeah, that to worry about. I'm an average size, nigga. Mm-hmm. Can't be tall. Don't know about that. That's it? I don't like too much. If I know that bitch, I'm going to be. That's your insecurity? Yeah, she tall. What? I don't really got that many, but I can say sometimes my confidence is kind of like fucks with it. So I just be like sometimes I be doubting it. Yeah. Just like it, like feeling good about myself. Like damn, I don't be feeling good enough. I ain't gonna lie. Like, I just like smoke. me because I'm Did just gonna change that though. They said don't rely, rely on confidence. Cause confidence, you only got that shit sometimes. You feel me? Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Yep. And then when I'm got it, like I ain't nothing. You feel like, like yeah, that? yeah. That that's gonna come with that shit at that mm-hmm. point. So you might as well just dry that emotion just like you do other ones. Nah, I ain't think about it like that. I'll say, obviously, I know this mm-hmm. one. It's my body. I mean, mm-hmm. never going to speak on that. Um, hmm, yeah, confidence is obviously one of them. Um, let me think. You know, I wish I had a photographic memory. <laughs> I'm insecure that I don't have that photographic memory that I just remember everything. Probably a blessing and a curse, but I would see the blessing more. Brian, what's your insecurities? Come on, because we already running at two minutes, two hours and thirty minutes. Mm-hmm. Trying not to make it that long, guys. Yeah. Or keep you up many. there. At that point, that's all you said. Yeah, yeah. Why well, y'all have insecurities? Is it because y'all are guys and I'm a girl? Y'all think too much about shit, bro. Mm-hmm. Or, yeah, yeah, but y'all be open to that shit. It is, yeah, it's because I'm a girl. So, That's what I'm saying. Go start going to the, the gym. World. Start going to the gym. That's that shit gonna erase all of that. Once you start locking in mentally, bro, 
It ain't shit nobody gonna be able no, to like, tell you. They're not you emotional. Gonna tell me? emotional. Yeah, yeah, I'm saying so. Especially yeah. if you already aware mm-hmm. of what you what you like, you feel me? So you don't pop mm-hmm. that as much. Yeah. Nigga, yeah. I know who I am. You feel me? You can't tell man, you can't make me feel less than I am, nigga. I know what I am. You can't man. tell me shit, gang. Man. I ain't gonna lie. Yeah, y'all niggas some fire ass content. <laughs> that was a, that was a really yeah, good episode. Yeah, I'm cat. Yeah. Oh, yeah, I'm really two bang. hours of top up. Yeah, yeah, I'm not going to lie. Yeah, y'all some other stuff. Yeah, we're going to get the little buzz like the good boy. Yeah. 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 This was probably the best episode. Second best.